What's good? What's good? What's good? What's good? What's good? How are we doing? How are we doing? Beautiful people. Glad to be here with you. Glad to be back on stream. You guys, I am so tired. <laughs> I am I am past tired. And I gotta be real. My fuse is about this long right now. So uh, I really hope Digiman Survives is not difficult today. If it is at all challenging, I'm I'm gonna rage quit so fast. Today is a day where neon white would not be an option. No chance. No chance. All right. But well, what's up, early gang? Early girly gang. Early Gucci girly gang. <laughs> nice that was that a good, was a good one. one and we're dropping frames and we're dropping frames that's gonna be a non-starter if we drop frames then I'm afraid that Nathan is going to lose his mind it would be in the best interest of everyone on the twitch platform and members of a spectrum ISP to be very careful of speeds on the intranet. Nice. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. So uh, I've thought about doing something new because I'm always thinking about the next new thing that I can do. And my current new thought is I'd like to start drawing again every day. And uh, I, uh, I don't know what to draw, so I thought it might be kind of fun if it was the same thing every day. Um, and I thought, what better thing to draw every day than my favorite pocket man's deli bird. So that's a contemplation. I've contemplated drawing a deli bird every day. It feels like I am so loud. I keep peeking like every time I talk. Is something up with the mic microphone? What's up, microphone? What's going on with the microphone, huh? I feel like I'm peeking. I don't know if something got shifted. If my daughter played with a played with a volume controller knob. I don't know what the deal is, but it looks, it looks, it's looking pretty sus, as the kids do say. Okay, I don't even know where my phone is, dude. Have I lost my phone? <laughs> I don't know where it is. Where could it be? Oh, there it is. I was going to say this could be a fun thing to do. We need the droid cam today anyway. Woo! Guys, I've broken yet another phone camera, or a phone case. And I'm not a fan. And it feels like it's happening on the regs now. I need that to slow on down. Walk right in, sit right down, baby, won't you slow on down? Let's see if this looks okay. Let us see. What's up, sneaky pigs? How we doing? I want to see how this looks real fast. It's not bad. It's the wrong angle. But it doesn't look terrible. The gotchas are restocked. Ba -da 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 -da. They are restocked. They have beans this time. It is done the proper, right proper like. It's done right proper like, yes. Okay, so what I need to do is, is to figure out how to do this. Thought this would be a fun little challenge for myself here. Oh man, Zando's bringing the heat. Bringing the heat. Words. Two gotcha ponds. And I have another gotcha pond, please. 
quest we weapon got in the way I might got chop on. Oh my god, chop on. Alright, now I see your movie movie game. What's up, Deacon Havoc? How we doing? Welcome, welcome, welcome. I saw y'all had a special guest on. Y'all it was it a special guest or is that a new um, member of the team? I wasn't able to actually join the stream. So I know little to nothing about it. Finally feel like a human this morning. COVID has kicked my butt. My dude, I'm so sorry. I heard that you were you're down with it. What a start! What a start, Zando! What a start, my dude. Ooh! What a start, all right? And for Zando's second segundo twill be, let's find out. A celebrity reading poetry. Celeb reads poetry, my friend. New member of the team, he is leading our Youth Connection streams on Sundays. What, that's dope. Congratulations on the new member of the team. I look forward to getting to meet him. Whew. All right, right or left? Helen picked the left bean. It's the red bean. I don't know what that one is. Let's find out. Oh, good, it's the bandage one. What's the good flavor? Pomegranate. Pomegranate or nasty, nasty uh, bandage. Helen picks left bean here to party, also known as lurk and work. All good, Steven. Welcome in. Oh, a movie guy is here. Oh no, I don't know. I don't know. I can't get my phone right now. I think I have 38 episodes left. And that sounds really right. And you guys are 174 in, I think. That that both of those sound really right. So I've listened to 136 episodes of the of the Moviga podcast. Uh, okay. Here we go. Nasty bandage. Bottoms up. It is, of course. Of course it is. <laughs> How is it hot? How is it warm? How do they make it taste warm? I don't understand. I mean, it's as if there's a heater inside of the bean. It's in there. <laughs> oh, it tastes like a pop cap every time. No. Oh. Disgusting. Disgusting. I do not like it. Big dude who says, oh, it's dedication. You've listened to more epi oh, episodes than I have. Pikachu? <laughs> okay, I'll try my best. Oh. Can it be can it be a burly Pikachu? Pikachu. That's disgusting, dude. I can't get the taste out of my mouth. I need some candy. I need it. Stat! Give me some candy, stat! Um, I will do my very best. I don't have a Pikachu, but I will I will do it. For Helen, I will make it happen. Pikachu. Wait, we're the Movie Ba podcast. You've been listening to the wrong one. No, I guess I'll just have to start over. Oh boy. Okay. Helen says short a burly Pikachu. So I'm gonna start doing a drawing called the Daily Bird Challenge. Where I draw a deli bird every day to keep me artistic. Um, but I need I need some kind of assistance to come up with either a pose or a drawing or a shape of some sort, something. Italian Pikachu. I'm a Pikachu here. Hey, I'm a Pikachu. I'm a Dona. What am I doing? What does Pikachu do? I'm walking here. I was gonna do some kind of a pun, but it's just gonna be that I'm walking here. Oh my goodness. I'm agility in here. Come on. It's a me. Oh, that bandage is awful. I'm lightning in here. Come on. All right. While I'm eating, I'm gonna do your movie again. Man. It's a Monday. Mondays I go and eat Mexican food. I had the delightful Mexican food. That's just spicy on the bowl, there. <laughs> That's the one spicy on the bowl. I love it. Let's back in here. Okay. Okay. <sighs> Movie Movie Game is a game that combines two movie titles together. Zando is the one that redeemed it, so I'm gonna let Zando get the first guess here. But uh, what I'm going to be reading is the prompt of these two movies that have been combined. Okay? 
Everybody understand? Good in the chat? Let Xando answer first, but it's two movie titles combined. If you get it, good for you. Good for you. If you get it and Xando doesn't get it, then steal it from him once he gets a chance to guess. Okay. <clears throat> A neurotic aquatic father searches the seas for his son who went missing in Textopolis while helping a visual representation of a human emotion discover himself. A neurotic aquatic father searches the seas for his son who went missing in Textopolis while helping a visual representation of a human emotion discover himself. Finding Nemoji movie. Chats in the clap. Very good, Zando. Zando, you never miss, man. You never miss finding the Moji movie. Such a good one. Such a good one. I love it. I love it every time. I love it every single time. All right. Let's do. Uh, let's just do. Uh, let's do a. Um, how long on the clock? That's the real question. Movie, movie game for Steven. You got it. Please. All right. Same. Same concept. Oh, that's very funny. <laughs> I don't know if you'll get this one, man. <laughs> okay. Okay, here we go. Here we go. <clears throat> um, I am going to have to say a dirty word if that's okay with everyone. Uh, but it's a very famous movie quote here. Uh... <laughs> oh, man. This is very inappropriate. Helen, cover your ears. <laughs> this one's very inappropriate. This is a family-friendly channel. This is not the worst word of all time. It's, it's the D word if your parents if parents out there are concerned about this. Um, but it is, frankly, my dear, I don't give a damn That's a ri that a rich dude just offered me $1 million to spend the night with my wife. Frankly, my dear... I don't give a damn that a rich dude just offered me one million dollars to spend the night with my wife. Maybe you'll get it because it's not that hard of a prompt. It's just <laughs> you got it, Zando. It's a good one. It's a good one. All right, and I see the doodle request, so uh, we'll just continue waiting on our daily bird here, on our daily bird. You know the first, but not the second. It's all yours. Go ahead, and Zando, claim it. It's so good. That's it. Gone with the wind. Decent proposal. <laughs> so good. I hadn't said it out loud yet, and I love it even more. All right, Helen. Helen. Uh, where was it? With a Pikachu on a leash. Helen walking Pikachu with a leash. This is a different doodle book for this one. Hello, first time watcher. Dropped in because Digimon survived. Watch up, Zarathos. No, go so seriously, we have a person that uh, frequents the channel named Zargothos. That is your exact name with a G before the second A. And I was like, you're not a first time watcher. But welcome. We're glad you're here. You're almost twin also frequents regularly. We're happy that you're here. We're glad to have you here. I do love Digimans. We are going to be getting into Digimans. We do have some things on the roster beforehand. I'm going to be drawing a Daily Bird. Daily Bird. I'm going to be drawing a doodle request here for Helen. I have an announcement to make. And we have some Pokemon cards to unbox over here. And then we're going to be getting into some Digimon Survive. So it is happening. It is happening. It just might be in a little bit. We have just gotten to a pretty pivotal point in the game um, at the very beginning. Probably the first pivotal point, some might argue. I think it's the first, like... Not the first boss, but like there's the tutorial boss and then there's the first boss after that. We're at that one, so there we go. Is it a nerd pastor named Nate? Blink if you need help getting out of your upstairs. Oh goodness, Perry. All right, well, welcome, welcome, Zarathos. We're happy that you're here. Is it Zarathos? That's how I'm gonna pronounce it, unless you correct me. Um, but that'll be that'll be the plan. Gosh, gone with the wind, decent proposal. So good, dude. All right. Um, okay, Google, set a 90 second timer. Okay, Google. Okay, Google. Okay, Google, set a 90 second timer. Now, oh, those Pikachu ears are wonky. I'm trying to think of how I would draw a Pikachu on a leash here. Mm, let's do Pikachu with little rabbit legs. And uh, we'll have it. We'll have it sitting like a dog since it's here. Um, 
those are the little red cheeks and well the black camera where it actually is so we're just gonna do it up there and then we're gonna have a leash over here and we're gonna have helen off to the side helen is gonna be wearing a dress today and she's gonna be having pigtails and she's gonna be very happy to be walking pikachu and let's see boink boink uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. 37 seconds. I still got tons of time. What else am I gonna do here? Um, and they're gonna be they're gonna be walking down the sidewalk. And there's gonna be a lovely little tree in the background. And another lovely little tree. Lots of lovely little trees in the background. And some grass. Maybe some grass shooting through the sidewalk there. Pikachu is big. That's a big Pikachu. It's also upside down, but you get the idea. I don't really like Pikachu's ear. This ear is a little wonky. It would be a little more pointed, but you get the idea. There you go. There's Helen walking a Pikachu. Whoop. Yay! What's up? What's the what the what the what's up? Okay, uh, you can call me Zara as well. That's what I mainly go by. All right, Zara, that's what I'll call you. I have 70 hours in Survive, so you definitely know where I'm at. I'm not going to worry about spoiling it for you. Um, I just met the wolf thing. The wolf thing and the old dude fell off the bridge, and that was very surprising. I was not expecting the old dude to fall off the bridge, but it, it happened. And I assume he's dead. I assume he's dead. Can you send that to Helen? I'll try my best to remember to send that to Helen whenever I send you your uh, stuff for all of the things that I've got to send now. My mail list is getting longer and longer as the days go by. Gotcha pot for Trump Bell. What's up, Doc? Thinking Whoa. about getting a gotcha Holy pot. Holy moly, bugs! Bugs, that was so loud in my ear. Mr. Blanc, sir. Back away from the microphone. All right. All right, our first Pokey badge goes to Trombone. Trombone, you got the heart badge. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You got the heart badge. I don't know what that, I don't know what that actually is. Also, Pikachu's tail is cut at the bottom. Right? Why do I always forget? That Mandela effect? I, I, it's, it's in there. That Mandela effect is one of the ones that pervades my memory space the most. All right, uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. let's see what else I missed. Today is very much a Monday trombone. Trombone, if I could recommend eat Mexican food on Mondays because it always makes me happier. Um, that is also what Marie recommends as well. Yes, I do. I really do. I recommend it every day. Oh, I don't have the five minute timer because I'm not on the right screen. Okay, Google, set a five minute timer. Okay, Google, set a five minute timer. Thank you. Okay, does this mean it restores my HP because I need that? Yep. I'll be listening to different samples of music later tonight. Rock on. At this point, it'll be easier for Nate to bring things to LTNCon instead of mailing them. For real, though, I probably will. One dollar taco Mondays. That's right. I'm at work, then I have work again. Are you door dashing me Mexican food to the dealership tonight? I mean, I would if I could, but I don't know if that's going to happen. How many Pokemon cards are we opening? I, they descended from me upon the heavens, Ando. I promise I didn't buy any more Pokemon cards. Yeah, I just stumbled. I was walking down the street. I was just walking down the street, and then the next thing I knew, there were Pokemon cards. So you can see how, how busted this is, dude. Look at this. The cards aren't even in the thing. The cards aren't even in the thing. I'm not buying another ETB. Here's the here's the myth of money, okay? The myth of money is as told by Mark. Would you like to tell them? Yeah, I would like to tell them. I will tell them the truth. Okay. Here's the problem with another. The another ETB means that Nathan has spent $150 on Pokemon cards and he refuses to accept it. So he will spend more than that on smaller increments of cards and fool himself into the fact that he's getting more for less, even though he's actually getting less for less. It is called capitalism and my man has it a late term. <laughs> That's it, Marie. Thank you, buddy. I appreciate it. Getting a hint of doofenshmirtz. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Maybe a little bit. Um, so I only have four. Only have four packs left to open. I think this will for real be the last four. You're going to kill me if you check the level two discussion where we tacos to your house tonight. You're not. You're not having the tacos at my place. If you have the tacos at my place, my wife would kill you. It's the first day. It's the first day of school, folks. First day of school with kids. My wife does not, my wife does not want to see another person 
as soon as she clocks out today. She doesn't really want to see me after she clocks out today, okay? So she has no interest in seeing friends and guests tonight. That's a, that's a big no. Yeah, not happening. Yes, McDoo, send me your address. Fine, next Monday. I doubt it, but maybe, maybe not. I think we need to do tacos whenever we eventually have a, a checkpoint church con. It'll happen. Some point. Some point. Not Monday, says Trombone. Gotta be not a Monday. But then they are not a dollar. If we wanted to be a dollar. But then we'd also have to do it in uh, in um, in here. My wife does nothing the first week of school with students. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Gotta lurk. I'm here in spirit. Thank you. I appreciate you being here. Maybe I should do... Um, I'm trying to figure out how to draw this deli bird, and you guys are being very distracting. You're not helping. You're not helping the process along, okay? You keep distracting me as soon as I'm ready to draw the deli bird. We're 15 minutes into stream, and I've not even started Digimon Survive. I've not even started the Pokemon cards. I've not even made our huge announcement yet. I've done literally nothing except for antics and eating a wet bandage. Bring a team and lead worship for it. That depends on if we have worship. We don't even know what it looks like yet. We have no idea. We got, we have no clue. Will Marie come? Do it's anybody's guess? Is anybody's guess. We're gonna get to Digimon Survive, Zara. I promise out there, it's gonna happen during our stream today. We got three hours of stream. So we're gonna be getting some Digimon Survive. Don't you worry. Don't you worry about a thing. Hey, quick poll in the chat. Type in the chat how many hours of sleep you got last night. I want to see I want to see if anybody got less sleep than I did. I bet you did, but it's probably very few of you. Back home, hey Marie. What is up what is up with the parry? I mean, chat ever provide ever anything other than antics and mayhem. Seven and a half, four booster packs. That's why I predicted in the Discord. It's definitely Ditto Day. I sure hope so, dude. <laughs> I don't know what else I'm gonna do. This is for real yet. I know I say this every week. I know I say it every single week. This is for real. Probably my last, my last um, Pokemon Go boosters. If I get more boosters, it will only be because I was getting the next expansion and I saw they still had some. Seven hours of sleep, seven and a half hours of sleep, almost eight hours, five to six hours. Nothing me. I actually slept last night from 10 to 6.30, but it wasn't restful. Oh, that's the worst. Isn't it? It's awful whenever you get a full, like, hourage. Like, you get the proper hourage, but you aren't actually, like, in it, you know? That is a bummer. I hate to hear that trombone. Actually, closer to 6.5 to 7, I fell asleep around midnight and woke up a little before 7. So, as I mentioned, it was the first day, the very first day of school. And so, my wife, my wife, um... That's about it, McDoo. Except I think I heard recently on a podcast, I think you just talked about it on a podcast, that you either just got diagnosed with it whenever I was listening to this podcast, however long it was ago, but you talk about kind of your struggle with ADHD, I want to say, and not getting sleep at night. You, took, you started taking medicine or something and it doesn't let you sleep at night. I swear that was something that was on a recent podcast that I listened to. But obviously I'm listening in reverse order, so it could have been a very old podcast. Um, dealing with a minor migraine, yay, and students are being more mundane than usual. Oh, no! Well, our youngest went through a growth spurt last night, so she had me up. Our oldest is still growing, going through a, um, going through a, um, what's it called? A bathroom regression. And so between the two of them, and waking up at 4.30 this morning so that my wife had time to get a shower and feed the baby before she had to get to school, I got approximately two and a half hours of sleep. And I'm so tired. So, so, so incredibly tired. All right, we're gonna, you know what we're gonna do for our very first deli bird? We're just, we're gonna go, we're gonna go run of the mill here. And I'm just gonna Google a picture of deli bird. Man, it's hard to type sideways, huh? I didn't realize how hard that was. Okay. We're gonna go with a run-of-the-mill deli bird. It's gonna be our very first one, and I realize this needs to be flipped. So maybe I ought to flip it. Let us transform, flip vertical, bam. That should, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Maybe Delaware is opening $150 worth of booster packs. That would be funny. 
have a booster pack, or I could even just have a Deli Bird card. Do I have a Deli Bird card? I don't think I do. Sounds like something I need to start looking for. All right. Um, standard Deli Bird, standard issue Deli Bird. Um, looks like he's got a circle. We want to draw him relatively small because I want more Deli Bird to fit on the page here. This is like a this is like a fisheye lens. The way I've got this going on right here. I'm gonna start with a pretty standard circle for a head, and we're gonna do like a, it's like a it's like a square, but a little bit wider for his body. And then he's got his adorable little feet out here, adorable little feet with just two toes. Um, he's always got one hand in the air in the pictures, the promo art. It's a little thin of an arm, but we can we can wedge it out a little bit later. Um, other one going down here, and then he typically has his bag in this hand and bag. Oops, that's a little too thin going around, around, around him. Yep, there we go. Okay. And then he's got his, like, headdress, which, like, fluffs out there a little bit, and then goes down, 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 round, down, and then fluff, fluff, fluff again. Um, and then it smooths around this side of the head, but on this side it does fluff out again before fluffing out up there, going in and out, and up here it goes out. Okay. Boink, boink. Point, 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 point. Yes. Up again. Point, 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 point. Love it. Okay. We need to have the huge announcement. You're gonna know. You're gonna know. I'm just building up hype. I'm allowing time. I'm allowing time for the hype to set in. It must be tacos at this house next Tuesday. It has to be the big announcement. It is not. Apparently, either that or he's buying all of the LTN, uh, well, two members LTN con tickets. Not happening. That would be quite generous of me, wouldn't it? Um, he's got his little eyes right here. Ba boink, ba boink. Ooh, those look like a little sunken, a little sunken and scary. And then his mouth is actually like right here, um, right a little too low, a little too low for comfort, which I guess means that I've made his eyes too small. So let's try and expand those out a little bit. But now they're too close together. <laughs> he just gets scarier and scarier. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, and then he's got, of course, so this is too long. But we're making it happen. It's too long here. It's got the single button. This needs to go down a little bit lower and around. Yeah, that's a spooky, scary deli bird right there. Spooky, scary skeletons, indeed. Um, he's got the black around the eyes, and then two eyes in the center. Yeah, that's deli bird right there. Now we do need to expand out his um, his wing a little bit, which that looks pretty fair. And I think this needs to come in a little more. This needs to come in a little more. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I only have 12 trainer cards. I obviously need some more booster packs so I can build a proper deck. Yeah, or just buy a deck. Just buy a deck and then fill it out from there. Believe me, you'll get enough in time. Somehow, miraculously, they just end up in your shopping cart and nobody knows how. Nobody knows how they get there, but they just do. They just do show up. All right, let's see if I can find a good, a good width marker here. That's almost too thin. Let's go for an XS here. Still too small. Still too small. Nope, way too thick. Ooh, that's kind of nice. Yeah, I think I like this one. Okay. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe that's not. Maybe that's not. I don't know. Ah! I, uh, does anybody else overthink their markers? Is that just a me thing? I overthink my markers like crazy. Let's um, draw on a piece of scratch paper here. No, that's pretty nice. That's pretty nice. Okay, 0 0.3. Let's remember that for the future, Nathan. Uh, okay. Remember what lines to follow. That's probably the trick. Let's start with his mask here.
Okay, we got the mask out. Uh, let's see. I did buy the Mel Metal deck. Very nice. You know, if the mods don't know about it, this is an actual announcement. No, more of you know about it than you think you do. You just don't know that I'm announcing what I'm announcing. I don't know who you are either. Who am I? What am I doing? How did I get here? I don't even know at this point. I don't even know most days. Breach. So this is just standard edition deli bird right here. Nothing fancy. Just pretty run of the mill deli bird. I just miss drawing, you guys. I miss drawing. If you get announces he's leaving online ministry at checkpoint to go work for a monastery deep in the mountains of Eastern Europe. If I get a ditto today, do I open the one I sent you? No, I tape it on the wall. I'm gonna stick a pen right through it. Um, I actually haven't gotten it yet. I haven't been to the mailbox. I go probably tomorrow. Or what you posted in the level two chat. Neither one of those things, Duck. A nice, a nice, oop, I forgot the top of his head. A nice little daily bird. All right, now for my favorite part. The best part of waking up is Folgers in your cup. Except Folgers is actually okay at best. The best part of work I guess I should have changed the category to art for just a minute. All right, so our standard run-of-the-mill daily bird is going to be our very first daily bird. Mm-mm-mm. Daily Bird! Let's see if I can get it to focus. Daily Bird! There we go. The first Daily Bird to happen on the Daily Bird page. So, I need more ideas of what will happen in the future for our Daily Birds. What other Daily Birds do we want to see? Um, what other shapes and sizes and fun things? So, be on the lookout for more Daily Birds. But I'm trying to get back into it. And I bought a whole notebook for it and everything. So, Daily Bird book. Daily Bird! Alright. Uh, Pokemon cards will happen after the announcement. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm not going to make you guys wait through another thing. I'm not going to make you guys wait through another thing. Although I should. I could. I could if you want me to. We have a huge announcement, folks. we got something really, really exciting coming up this week. This week, some very cool and exciting stuff happening. So, some of you have seen for the past little while, um, Maybe you've heard me talk about on Fridays uh, that we're going to be doing um, podcasts every other Friday. And you've probably asked yourself, and you may ask yourself, this is not my beautiful wife. Um, you maybe have been asking yourself, okay, so we know about the Nerds of Prey podcast, but what's going to be the other podcast? Are you, gonna, are you making a new one? Are you reposting an old one? Are you, are you bringing one across somewhere? What's the plan, Nathan? What's the deal? What are we doing? Well, I'm here to tell you about what we're doing. We have an exciting new announcement 
A new podcast will be launching this Friday, and the name of the podcast will be, drumroll please, the Level 2 Podcast! Woo! Shots in the clap, and the crowd went wild! That was y'all going wild. That was the that was the the auditorium bursting into applause at the excitement of a brand new podcast, Level Two Podcast, starting this Friday. Now, some of you may be wondering, what in the world is Level Two Podcast? What are we talking about? What are we talking about? What is that? What's the deal with that? What's going on here? Level Two Podcast is going to be a new monthly podcast. So we're going to alternate every other Friday, just like we said. One Friday is going to be the Nerds of Prey. Then two Fridays from then is going to be a new episode of Level Two Podcasts. The Level Two Podcast is going to be about whatever it's about. The easy answer is that it will change every single month. What will also be changing is that it's going to be a rotating cast of two to three different Level 2 members joining us to talk about that month's topic. For instance, it could be anything as far as this month's topic, which will be airing this Friday, uh, that's going to be, what is a nerd church? That's going to be the topic. It's pretty broad, right? But... At the same point, we thought we might might, uh, might talk a little bit about what it is that we're doing to get us started with this podcast. But we're going to be talking about themes such as violence. We're going to be talking about anime. We're going to be talking about what we can and can't play, how games have impacted us, how they've changed our lives. Big stuff coming up. Level 2 podcast hitting the airwaves this Friday, 2 o'clock. Watch it live. Uh, it is pre-recorded, but watch it live together on our Twitch before it goes live over on all of our streaming platforms uh, for your viewing pleasure so that's the level two podcast uh it's always going to be featuring two or three level two members and then myself in a round table kind of discussion on anything and everything dealing with the nerd church and the stuff ongoing here at checkpoint church what is a level two member you may ask well allow me to tell you a level two member is somebody that has taken the mindset shift in this community to no longer just be served by checkpoint church but to serve alongside checkpoint church these are just people that want to serve you they want to serve this community and this is one of the ways that they're going to be doing it so that is starting up exclamation point level two if you're interested in learning more about level two maybe you want to be a level two person when will duck makes things be a guest on it i'm willing to talk about just about anything duck we've already put out the um the signups for the first year's worth so that's quite a few quite a quite a few that are coming out but um i would encourage you to check out that list somewhere on the on the thing or just keep an eye out for if anybody ever has to dip um i'll put out uh, reminders about it and say, hey, we need somebody to fill this slot. Um, if you are a level two person, we'd love to have you on. Just a matter of being in the right place at the right time to find out when we need people for that. Okay, <clears throat> now the moment you've all been waiting for, Pokemon cards. This is filthy, isn't it? Look at all that sugar. I don't like that at all. That's all sugar. That's all sweet and sour sugar from these. If you've never had the Haribo Sour Streamers, might I recommend them? You can see I did a terrible job opening these. Normally I have scissors and I just cut right along the top and it's very nice and neat and organized. Today I was desperate because I had a wet bandage in my mouth and I needed to get the taste out. Pokemon cards. I am not happy. I'm not happy about this. I'm not happy about the fact that I've bought these and I'm not gonna be happy if I don't get a ditto today. But at this point, I'm almost, I'm almost just thinking I'm not gonna be getting a ditto. And so I think since I'm so certain that I'm not gonna get a ditto, that means today's gonna be the one where I do. Yeah, maybe, doubt it. Pokemon cards. Here we go. Moment of truth. We got four packs. There are four back there. These two have fallen inside, which gives me doubts just really gives me doubts uh but you know we're gonna we're gonna make it work i'm at this point convinced they didn't send any dittos to north carolina because i've not heard of anybody in north carolina getting one sour streamer nate in about 15 minutes after opening this packs with no ditto you're right you're right i'm really gonna need it now we got to make sure there are four in here okay there are perfect oh no did i just show you guys my codes no i don't think i did don't steal my codes so that's something that I have thought about. If we seriously don't get any dittos today, I've thought about redeeming all of these codes in the online app and just having an absolute uh, redemption fest. Redemption fest sounds like something that a church would actually put on. Uh, putting on an absolute redemption fest. Oh no! Over on, um, on everything. So that might be the plan. We'll see. We'll see. If I don't get a ditto today, that might be what I do. That might be what I do. Time will tell. All right, we got four. Point. 
Four cards. Boink, boink, boink. Boink, boink, boink. Four chances. We have four chances for a ditto. Four chances. That's all we got. If we don't get it, we don't get it. This is it. The moment. You own it. You better never let it go. You've only got one shot. Do not miss your chance to flow. Does he say flow there? This opportunity comes one minute in a lifetime. You've had a chance to blow. Ugh, man. Because of that, I'm not going to get a ditto. All right. Let's get into it. Three cards to the front. Moment of truth. Only one of these cards is going to potentially be a ditto, and I'll tell you when we get there. I have so many dupes. I have so many dupes, you guys. Soul Rock. Eradicate. Larvitar. Rattana. Spinnerk. Pikachu. This is it. This, is, this, this could be a ditto. Moment of truth. I don't... Why is this happening? How is this happening? How do I keep doing this? I don't, I don't understand. This is a crazy rare card. This is an incredibly rare card. I should be so thankful for this shiny Blastoise. But all I want, dude, <laughs> all I want is that stupid ditto. Ah, okay. All right. Hey, you know, I've gotten the Radiant Blastoise and the Radiant Venusaur and not a single ditto. Tyranitar. I can't believe I just got a Radiant Blastoise. Oh my gosh, that's such a rare card. Oh, he's so gorgeous. Look at him. He's gorgeous. How? Tell me how. How can this be? How can I straight up get a shiny Blastoise? Thank you for the follow, Zarathos. I promise we're getting to Digimon Survive. We're so close. We're so close. It is the next thing we do. I swear. <laughs> I swear it's the next thing we do. I appreciate your patience. Oh, boy. All right, here we go. One, two, three to the front. Moment of truth. Pokestop. Starting out with the trainer card. That's a weird card to start with, actually. You got the shiny Blastoise, too? That's crazy rare, my friend. Radiants are super hard to come by. Is that two? That's one to put in a plastic protector. Data. Numble. Alolan Radicate. Oh, I still got a couple. Tranquil. Larvitar. Moment of truth. Moment of truth. Here we go. This is the one. This is the ditto. I hope you're all ready to see a ditto. I don't understand. I don't understand. I love Moltres. That's such a cool card. It's such a cool card. And it was. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna look through them just to make sure. I'm pretty sure it can only be a reverse hollow, but I'm just gonna make sure. I just wanna make I just wanna make totally sure. Yeah. 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 Alright. Dosmas. Dosmas. Two more. Two more. This is it. This is all we got. It's only Numel, Spinarak, and Pit of. Are you sure it's not also Apom? I know it's, I know, I think it was Magikarp too. One, two, three to the front. <sighs> you guys, I'm running on so little sleep and all I want, all I want is my ditto. Lots of rare dupes to send you for that ditto. I don't want your ditto though. It doesn't feel real. I didn't earn it. Okay. Here we go. 
We already know it's not one. Yep. Blanche. Colossopod. What am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? I've spent so much money on these stupid Pokemon cards. I don't even like the Go-Cards go -card this much, okay? They're fine at best. There are not even that many cool ones in here. I'm getting to the, I'm getting to the, whatever, whatever's the, what's the next phase? <laughs> the next phase of loss and <laughs> denial. One, two, three to the front. <sighs> I'm blaming. Blaming, naming, framing. I'm in the blaming phase. Here we go. Lore module. This is it. This is our last chance. If there is no ditto in here, I'm not getting a ditto. I know you're so angry when you literally have a ditto in your P.O. box. As someone who's gotten two dittos, I can assure you it isn't hard. Every time I've bought packs, I've gotten one. You're killing me. I don't even feel like looking at the rest of the cards. I mean, this is it. This is the last chance we have at a ditto. That's it. No dittos. We do not get a ditto. We are going to next week try online to see if we can get a digital ditto. But I'm not spending another dime on the Pokemon Go set. There's no way. I can't emotionally do it. I can't believe I got a Radiant Blastoise too, dude. So we'll try for a Digiditto next week and we'll see if we can get it. If I remember to redeem all my codes, that is. We'll see if we get it there. If we do, good. If we don't, be gone. <laughs> be gone, Pokemon Go deck. Trying to think of how many we've been through. Trying to think of how many we've been through. Two ETBs, that's 20. We've been through two of those Executor packs, that's 28. We've been through two of the Blanches, that's 40. Uh, I probably got some single boosters, so we've, we've probably been through about 50 packs. We've probably been through about 50 packs of Pokemon cards and have not gotten a single ditto! Whew! Sweating. Sweating. Sweat. That's so much Buco Dolores on goofy, goofy cards and not a single ditto. Oh, man. Oh, man. They got me with this Pokemon Go. They absolutely got me with this one. I'm so bummed. All right, Digimon Survive. I guess we'll play Digimon Survive. I guess if I'm going to have fun today, I'll play Digimans. Gerudo Valley's helping me as best it can. Whoop. All right. Let's go for a little external cap. By the way, if you guys can see, I see uh, we have Delibird and Bulbazar over here. Oop. If level two chips in for one more ETB, do we get a special stream? Sure. Sure, I'll special stream whatever you guys want. <laughs> At this point, who even cares? Who cares? I've given up. All right, Digimans. Oh, I forgot they were over on the side. That's right, because we're reading the bottoms. <laughs> oh, you guys are so tiny. What's up, everybody? All right, Zarathos, we're finally playing your game. I'm so sorry it took so long. 45 minutes, Zarathos has been sitting here. I can't promise you're going to like all my voices either. Suspended battle. I forgot we were mid-battle. Yeah, we're fighting the big boss. Okay, let's go for it. Can you guys hear that music? It's not coming through my headphones. It's coming through my speaker, and I want to make sure that that's working. Of course, now it stopped. Of course it did. What's down on the bottom? Why can I? Why are there like two things overlapping down there? Is that a loading screen, maybe? I thought the loading screen was a little Agumon. Agumon! Digivolve 2! Uh, Zarathos, you said you have 60 hours in this game, yeah? Tell me how long it takes me to get a Terriermon. Because I want Terriermon, and so far he hasn't shown up in any of the um, random battles. I need him. I need him in my life. He's my favorite Digimon, and I want him so bad. 
I need to know how long it takes. Okay, what's going on? Could this game load any longer? <laughs> Think we could load any longer here? It's a visual novel. Let's calm it down on the loading. It's a visual novel. Maybe I need to close out of the game. It's like we got too many cookies. <laughs> okay, here we go. All right, dope. All right, moment of truth. We gotta take down this demon dog. Please let me know if you can't hear that, friends. So I know there's I know there's poops down here, and I kind of feel like I should I should also mess with them. Why does it keep turning off? Am I hitting the wrong button? I'm hitting B. Oh my goodness. What is this amateur hour? Uh, I kind of feel like I should take down the poops. Because I feel like they're going to start to mess me up. But I also want to really stick together as a team. We go together like dooba zooba dooba zooba dooba 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 bop Chang chang bop da bop da bop At the way you Whoa whoa But for real, please do let me know if you can't hear anything. You should be hearing the game right now. The Digivolution is up and coming. Can you hear? Can you see? Do you know what's coming? Bird person. Bird person, do you reach? You do not. You're so close, too. Well, I guess I should be talking. At least get a little energy boost. Energy, energy, in my eyes, Doberman. I gotta remember all their voices now. Alright, there goes Poop. Ooh, they're all defending. Interesting. Yeah, I feel like I should- I feel like we should all work together. I feel like we should take down the poops. We're gonna take down the poops. You can't stop the poops. Oh, Nice. Pepper breath. Ooh, that really did not do much damage. Okay. Not too much damage. Let's talk to Saki. Just getting started. Because I know I have Lotmon, but I want Terriermon. Lotmon's pretty close, but not close enough. Team that sticks together. Interesting. So I guess Saki is an important character, huh? How is everyone's weekend out there? If you're out there watching, chilling in the chat. How was the out of the weekend treat you? I hope that it was good for you. Hope that everybody's feeling good, looking good. Doing good. <sighs> Interesting. Fun weekend visiting friends in Central PA for the end of summer shindig. That's very fun. Does that mean that summer is officially over? Is summer over when Perry says? Ooh, the demon dog defends. So I don't know if we should go down there or... Now do we storm? Maybe? I don't know what to do! Noelle starts preschool next week, so yeah, I think so. Oh no! Decent weekend, dampened by a diddleless Monday. I know, right? Believe me, nobody's as bummed as I am. Doo-doo! 
So we all stormed that poop mod, and now I'm just totally changing my mind, huh? What tangled webs we weave. I really thought they would storm a little more. Storming, I think storming. Storming, norming, forming. Ben and Helen both start preschool next week, four days a week for three hours. Super psyched to have productive mornings. Isn't that wonderful? Happy y'all are gonna be able to make that work. That's always good. Yeah, we're officially back into it as well. Back into the swing of things. See, now I don't want to leave him on his own. Bird person's back up here. We've practically wasted the entirety of the game so far. Riveting gameplay. Remember when that guy died? Do you guys remember when that guy died? You're all acting like this is just a normal fine thing, but that guy died earlier. He's dead. He's gone. He's gone, and it's not totally not our fault. Because we definitely had the ability to help him, and we just didn't. We just kind of stood here. Bye, incoming student. See you, trombone. Have a great day at work. Thanks for being here. Thanks for hanging with us. Appreciate you. Whoopsie, wrong way. That's fine. Ain't nobody gonna come get him. Ain't nobody gonna come get him. How'd you guys feel if I said something really controversial? Does that make you uncomfortable? I've got something that's weighing me down right now. And I feel like I need a platform to vent this into. But I'm also worried that if I do this, it will just, it'll ruin perception of me for a long time, you know? And I just can't have that. But I feel like I need to say it to somebody, or else it's gonna eat me alive. It's one of those, you know? We already know you like ice. That is pretty controversial of me. It's, it's a similar variety of con controversy. No, it is, um, I'm sure we're all familiar with now. Anybody that's on TikTok is familiar with the Shmoyoho, uh, corn song. I just gotta be real. I just gotta be real. The corn song, you guys, is really just okay. Please don't cancel me. I'm begging you. I need this. My children... My children need a place to sleep at night. You don't know at all what any of this is about? It's the newest Shmoyoho hit on TikTok. And I just gotta be real. I don't, I don't get it. It's not for me. Am I old now? Or am I canceled? Am I old now? Or am I canceled? The, the big difficulty for me is that I, I, I am unable to sing any of it. You know who Shmoyoho is though, right? Because you are an old man. If you're an old internet user, we all know Shmoyoho. Hide your kids, hide your wife, hide your kids, hide your wife. So corn is their newest meme. For me? I really like corn. And it's fine. It's fine, but I refuse to accept that it is anywhere near as good as like half of their other stuff. They have so many good songs and Korn is fine, but a magnum opus, it is not. And I'm tired of pretending like it is. Me, for me personally, the backing up song is probably my favorite. I'm backing up, backing up, backing up, backing up. Cause my mommy taught me good. I'm backing up, and I'm like, oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god. That's the best one. There's no, none of them, they will never make one that compares to that. That is their magnum opus.
that is their work of art that they will never possibly create another of. That intruder is great, though. How are we going to take down this demon dog? He's just kind of brooding up there. Making me all nervy. Growl arm. Growl arm. Growl. I growled at him. I growled, bunch of you scared. Well, it does not take long on the TikTok to find the corn song right now. It is popping off. I don't appreciate you overlooking the Five Guys song. Which one is the Five Guys song? Like I said, they have plenty of good ones. They got plenty of bangers. And the corn song is fine. It's good. But people are acting like it's the best thing they've ever made. And I just, I can't tolerate. I can't tolerate it anymore. Ooh. Poison chance. Oh, five guys. It's the, um... Get a grocery bag. Cheese is oozing. Let's do this. I didn't know that was five guys that he was eating. Oh, no! Blast coffin! Yeah, here on my Christian Minecraft server, we'd have to call that song Dang, Dang, Dang. So. <laughs> Bad Hacker, yes. This is uh, Digimon Survive. We're in a boss fight right now. It's going uh, slow. We we de digivolved. We de evolved. Oh no, we need SP. I wasted all of my SP. Oh dear. Oh dear. I think I've made a terrible mistake. I didn't really understand how SP worked. Okay, the good news is Diatramon has plenty. It is a little bit like a Tactics, but Digimon. But it's not really quite as good as Final Fantasy Tactics, at least not so far. Doesn't mean it's not gonna be. Oh wait, I need uh, the Digivolve. Dit, 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 dit. How was your weekend, Bad Hacker? We're glad you're here. Welcome to the stream. Happy Monday. I am personally, I'm personally a big fan of uh, Fire Emblem games. So that's probably where I'm coming out this game from more than Tactics. The Tactics games are also quite good. Ice! So Ice, I had to tell him twice. Man, Saki's Digimon goes so far. All right, bird person. I'm also a fan of the dead giveaway track. Those two get stuck in my head more than any of them. Dead. Okay, now I just switched over to my headphones. Are you guys hearing an echo now? Because my phone just decided to, to send it to my headphones. Let me know if you're hearing it an echo or twice or whatever. Oh, OBS, you kill me. You kill me, OBS. Good, good. Blessed to be here. Love Fire Emblem. I bought that Fire Emblem Heroes DS about 10 years ago. That's dope. No, Lopmon! Lopmon took one for the team. Growl.
grew up on JRPG turn-based games. Those are some of my favorites. Actually just made a top 10 list of my top 10 JRPGs. And I already can't remember what's on it. That's how bad my short-term memory is. But you can always find all that stuff on my backlog. Uh, I need to add my link tree, don't I? That would probably be a smart thing to do. A nerd pastor Nate link tree on here. So what everybody, uh, Legends of Dragoon or Grandia 2, I know neither one of those is on there. I've honestly never played either one of those. But it sounds like I need to if they're up that high on your list, yeah? Tell me more. Tell me more, tell me more. Because I'm super behind on all my games. I got to get through Xenoblade 3 somehow, and that game is so long. We did it. We beat the demon dog. Dragoon is top five for me easily. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. What era is that? This is something I would find, PS1 is something I would find easily in a retro store. Early PS1. The golden age. The golden era. My golden era was probably PS2 and GameCube. That was whenever I was playing the most games. I don't know if you guys can hear me okay. I'm gonna bring the mic in a little closer because I'm tired. We did it! It was tough, but we took it down. You, you guys are amazing. What the heck is going on? There's a lot to explain. Did you all, like you said, a lot to explain. Lotman is best friends with him now. I wouldn't call us friends. That's because you're so mean. I think she was like Valley Girl. Mm. But you're so cute. I skipped it when it came out. Ooh. What's happening? Why is he laughing? I skipped it when it came out and everyone who loved it around me was not looked upon favorably uh, upon it on recent replays. Ooh, interesting. Interesting, interesting, interesting. <laughs> Ooh, he real close. You don't have to be that close to me, dude, Ski. Huh? <laughs> You're much tougher than I thought. What, after all that, you can still move? $60 added to the wish list. Yeah, I don't know if it's worth 60. I think this should, I think this should probably, probably be a $29.99 or a $40 game. But I've also heard the story to this game is crazy long, so. I guess you get your money's worth if you think about it as far as if you're playing it for all it's worth. He's really stubborn. No, we can't afford to give up now. Yeah, and I'll protect Owie. But you're totally beat. You're still willing to fight for us? They must have reached their limit by now. I don't think we have any strength left. One against so many? <laughs> Hardly seems fair. Did he run away or is he getting help? Wait, did he run away? We're saved. We survived somehow. For the time being. Oh, I have the PS Classic. If it's on the Classic, I have it. Chops from Legend of Retro was always singing its praises, but when it came time to finally record an episode, he backpedaled on his thoughts. Interesting. Did y'all do Let's Plays on Legend of Retro? Or are you just talking about For the Pod? For the time being, let's... Let's get out of here. We got all our friends except for the professor who's very much dead. Um, I would say let's rest. Whether it's here or there, let's rest. We need to get somewhere safe, but we should rest for a bit first. We can't even stand. I'm wrong, it isn't on there. No! Well, I definitely have it. That would have been nice. I'm sure I can find it somewhere. We did some retro relapse style let's plays. Very cool. Yeah, it's fine. We're too exhausted. I'm in no state to complain anymore. Thanks. Let's rest a little and then head home. But what happened to the professor? Uh, it was hard to say, and as I hesitated, someone else said it. Hey, look! Down there! Oh, the fog. Is he still alive? Let's get out of here, Takuma. That fog is dangerous. Yeah. It's so th thick. Just looking at it gives me the shakes. But maybe, just maybe, the professor might still be alive? Huh? He fell before the fog came in, right? Maybe the fog didn't touch him. I mean, we don't know for a fact that he's dead, right? Tr 
true, we lack proof we cannot even see a body from here. Yet, even without the fog, a fall from his height. We, we can't know for sure. I'll go down and look. Minoru, hang on. Don't stop me. No, I'll go with you. I want to make sure. I'll go too. Even if there's a chance he's still alive, we have to help him. I'll help too. I can't let you go without me. Let me go first. Hey, I'm going too. Okay, let's all search for the professor. Reminder, they've only just met this man. They keep calling him professor like they're like, well, well acquainted. We've had one conversation with this dude. Oh, there was a canal down there. He might really, he might really be okay. Let's head downstream. He might have been carried away by the flow of the water. He might be able to hear us then. Call out to him. Professor! Professor! That's a cool action pose of Owie. Professor, where are you? Hey, Professor! Ooh. What was that? Thanks for your lurk, Perry. Ooh. Wait, who said that? The thing might be nearby. Takuma, I'm still... It's okay. I'm just gonna have a look around. I'll be extra careful. Are we gonna have to go through a painstakingly slow fan going for again? Hey, Fangmon. Sure enough, <laughs> it didn't take long to find you. He's there, but... Wow, he's really been roughed up. Yeah, he must have got hurt worse than we thought. That's a problem, but... Did that thing just get caught up in the fog? Right? The fog rolled over its feet, and then it couldn't move anymore. Even the monsters are affected by the fog. Nobody asks Digimon if they want rest, right? I wonder why. That fog is scaring me even more the more I look at it. I get what Shuji's saying. Agumon and the others are backing off. Ryu can't even stand the sight of it. I... <laughs> what? Observation is key. So many things to try. I'm scared, of course. <laughs> okay. I don't, I guess, observation. Let's see how he's doing. Let's keep an eye on him. That's fine by me, I suppose. I don't want to be scared. I'm going to say, let's see if he's hurt. It's scary, but if we close our eyes, we won't learn anything. We should watch it. We might find some way to deal with it. We just can't know. Urgh, what was that? Stay away. Don't come any closer. Is that Fangmon freaking out? No! No, this can't be happening! No! Huh? <laughs> ah! The fog! It got Fangmon! It swallowed him up! That was crueler than I could have imagined. I could have imagined worse, actually. None of us can even speak. What is the fog? Is it the smoke monster from Lost here? What are we working with here? That's what I need to know. All right. Part three. Wow. Part three. Thought he would devolve. Bro ran out of SP. I don't even know what Fangmon's rookie is. <laughs> You're so annoying. I don't know her voice. Why do you always have to boss me around? Boss you around? I'm just trying to keep you safe. And it's ruining my life. I'm sick of it. Leave me alone. Toothmon. That's it. Mew, this is not the time. Look around, would you? This place is messed up. I guess it does seem a little strange. I don't know what happened, but it's been like this since we woke up. As if both of us passing out at once wasn't weird enough to begin with. So I want you to listen to me. You're not going off on your own. Ugh, stop telling me what to do! You're not the boss of me! Maybe not, but I am your brother, and I worry about you. Oh, right, I forgot. When Big Brother gets worried, he can do whatever he wants. Or not. Besides, you may be worried, but last time I checked, I was fine. Not even a scratch, and you're worried about fainting? Seriously? It never happens! I've now fainted once in my entire life. It's a teeny problem. You're being ridiculous. Mew. And sure, maybe we got lost somehow, but don't you think that's kind of exciting? Exciting? What is wrong with you? Eee. What was that just now? You think it was an earthquake? No, it keeps happening. It's more like giant footsteps. But they're so loud. It couldn't be another monster, could it? No way! Stop trying to scare me! Right. I'm gonna go get a better look. What? Kaido, stop! Don't leave me alone! I might have to get closer to the monster. We'll be safer apart. I'll be right back. You stay right there, okay? Don't move. 
Me and my ponytail are going to look over here. Kaido, don't go! He went. He did, in fact, go. <whistles> Climb up a tree? I bet I could get a good view from this tree. I need to at least figure out what's stomping around. Hmm? I see something moving with a great angle. <laughs> Just to focus on his belly button. What is that thing? Is that what was making all that racket? <laughs> its right arm is like a tower of pure muscle. One hit from that thing and I'd be done for. Anyway, now that I know something dangerous is nearby, time to get back to Mew. Yeah. Okay. Mew, we're in danger. We have to get out of here now. But the Mew was missing. Ba Boom! Mew, what's wrong? Can you hear me? Come on, this is no time for tricks. Mew, answer me. I have a feeling Mew's Digimon is going to be Impmon. M Mew? Mew! Loading. We're always waking up in strange places in this game, huh? Excuse me. Morning, Agumon. Morning, Takuma. Hmm. Looks like Minoru and the others are still asleep. I wonder if the girls are up. Yeah, I wonder. Want to go see? Hmm. Better not. They'll come to the cafeteria when they're ready anyway. Thank goodness, I got a little worried. Um, after finding Shuji and Saki yesterday, we managed to make it back here safe. But what I was not ready for the conver but I was not ready for the conversation that happened next. Were you able to pick your starter? No! No, and I need Zara to come back because I need to know if I can get Terriermon. You need to know because I want Terriermon. Now, so far they've picked all of them for you, but you can catch them. You can convince them to join your team persona style um, throughout the game. Well, I'm sure we're all pretty worn out in more ways than one. We should get some rest. Didn't you just wake up? Oh, this was last night. Always like Gabumon over Agumon? Yeah. Yeah, I like Gabumon too. I'm a fan. I, I, I like really all the Digimon, but Terriermon is my favorite. Yeah, I can barely stay on my feet. Shuji, what's wrong? Uh, stay away from me. I'm sorry. Um, wait, am I missing something? You don't expect all of us to sleep in here, do you? There's plenty of space. What's the problem? Look at all these nice clean sheets, too. And no, I mean boys and girls in the same room. Magna Agumon was a G or Angemon. Yeah. Hanjimon! Hey, don't worry about it. We've got way bigger problems than that right now. Are you crazy? How is this something you expect me to just not worry about? Uh -huh. Girls need privacy. What about when we need to get changed or take a bath? She does have a point. Up until now, I've just been doing all that somewhere else. What? So the, you boys had to her, her go off on her own? That's awful. Show some consideration. Yeah, you tell him, Zaki. Floramon, please do not make things worse. But we never know when we might get attacked. We thought it was safest to stick together. Anywhere in the school would be fine. Or is that your deviant little excuse to spy on us? Gross. What? Takuma? No, it's not like that at all. What does she mean, deviant? You don't know, Agumon. It's something that changes from one thing into another. Like a caterpillar that becomes a butterfly. Isn't that right, Kunamon? Koo! Wow, you're both really smart. That sounds like evolving. Hehe, <laughs> if there's ever anything you want to know, just ask me. No, I believe in this instance, uh, <clears throat> on second thought, never mind. The point is, we should have separate rooms. Honestly, I hadn't thought about it before, but Saki's right. It seems like an obvious thing to me. Hmm, <laughs> like it even matters. We're never getting out of here, never. I feel like we're being wrongly accused here. What do you think, Takuma? Yes, let them have let them have their own room. Come on. Yes, of course. Of course, I was a youth pastor. Come on. 
Saki has a point. I feel like we've been rude. No, I should have said something. Don't blame yourself, Owie. They're the ones who need to apologize. Really, Saki, it's okay. As for where the two of you should sleep, Haru, can I ask you something? How would everybody feel if the girls slept in the music room with Haru and Miyuki? Miyuki's a girl and Haru's still young. Okay. I guess I'd be okay with that. Yeah, me too. Okay, so would it be alright if these two slept in the music room with you? What? But we don't. Hmm? Miyuki's giving Haru some kind of look. <sighs> Fine, it's okay, I guess. Great, thanks a bunch. Did she convince him? She may be on the quiet side, but she is the older of the two. All right, now seriously, let's all get some rest. Didn't really need this scene. This whole scene was unneeded, to tell the truth. Hanjo Aman! Can't say I expected Saki to jump to that conclusion. Give a guy a little credit. Still, could be that she's just kicking up a fuss to put on a brave face. We were freaking out about losing everyone, then ran into the professor. And then look what happened to him. He got pushed off a bridge. <laughs> what? Oh, well, we all agreed to meet in the cafeteria last night, right? Maybe I should head over. Thank goodness they didn't show me that scene. Morning, Takuma. Hey, Minoru. Morning. Everybody looks so sad! Oh. Hmm. Ryo, Shuji, good morning to you too. Minoru doesn't exactly look chipper, and these two seem particularly upset. Not that I blame them after what we saw. Yeah, same here. It's, it just doesn't seem right. The professor was the only adult here, and he vanished into the mist. Now it's just us kids, and none of us know what to do. You had met the man for five minutes. But it's no fun if everyone's down in the dumps. Yes, even my jokester of a partner seems rather despondent. I wish we could cheer them up. No, don't do that. Can't you read the room? The room? How? You can read rooms? What? Oh, uh, that's not what that means. Uh, help. Now, now, Agumon doesn't mean anything by it. Are you guys always like this? Such behavior is typical for Agumon. Likewise for Kunimon and myself. Coo. Labramon isn't here right now, but she usually keeps Agumon in line. Oh, okay. Well, things didn't get so rowdy with us. The professor kept everyone going while Foreman and Thuggy would encourage me. Yes, from what I saw yesterday, your partner seems rather unreliable. Even even though he's the biggest one? Bigger doesn't always mean better. Besides, he seems rather harsh with Lopmon. It's, it's not that bad. Well, all of our partners are young. We cannot expect them to be perfect. It falls to us to protect and support them so they act, might act properly. I'm going to do this, Professor. Just watch. I'll get everyone out of here. I will. We, we can't just keep grieving forever. Those tears don't exactly help your argument, Shuji. Minoru, try to appreciate what Shuji's going through. He spent a lot more time with the professor, so it's a bigger loss for him. Give him time. I mean, I'd like to, but we kind of need Shuji as our leader. After him, the next oldest is Aoi uh, and Ryo, I guess. Of those three, Shuji's the only real choice. I need to be strong. <laughs> yeah. We definitely can't spend all our time grieving. <sighs> we need to assess the situation. Now, you told me about the school and your supplies. Actually, now that I think of it, how did you spend the night, Shuji? Outside. Yikes, that's rough. No wonder he's been so high strung this whole time. I'd be the same if I spent an entire day running for my life. All right, let me tell you everything that happened from the beginning, and I'm gonna say it out loud in text form for us to read. Let me show you a flashback to the entire game as we've played it so far. I explained about how we found the school, meeting Agumon and the others, the fight against the spider monster, meeting Haru and Miyuki, and more. Yeah, but I'd still say you were the ones playing in hard mode. True, if it hadn't been for the professor, I don't know what might have happened. Just the thought of being hunted down by that terrifying thing. No thanks. What even was that anyway? It kept babbling on about children and sacrifices. That fits with what the professor had said about the kimonogami and human sacrifices. Maybe we should. Maybe we wouldn't be in the dark like this if we could just ask the guy. Or I mean, what the heck are live? I did forget to ping in general. I did forget to ping in general, Blish. But we are Poggy live. What's up, my dude? How we doing? It's 8 p.m. Where are you at? Oh, that's right! 
Oh my goodness, how you're in Germany, yes? I don't know any German. <laughs> Hallo. Hallo. I think is German. <laughs> H-A-L-L-O. Hallo. I should probably shut my mouth. Just had a yummy dinner. Wonderful. Oh my goodness. How is Strim? Strim is going great. We made our huge announcement that the Level 2 podcast is going to be coming this Friday. It's going to be airing every, every, uh, every other month or every month. We're going to alternate back and forth between the Level 2 podcast and between the um, Nerds of Prey. Big stuff coming up. That was the big announcement. I did not get a ditto, and I'm very sad about it. Yeah, there's no turning back the clock now. One thing's for sure, there's some weird monsters out there, not to mention that fog. Oh, well, Xando's got you. We distracted Nerf Pestronate from playing Digimon for 45 minutes. Got zero, di zero dittos, yep. I did draw a deli bird. That was nice. Yeah, that big wolf thing just vanished right into it. I wonder what happens if you get swallowed by the fog. Can't say. Agumon and the others want nothing to do with it, that's for sure. Clearly, we'd better watch our step, too. When you're right, you're right. What if there's just copies of the school and the mountain way out over these ruins? What if this is all some kind of huge prank? What's a prank? It's this type of joke where you trick people for laughs, especially celebrities. Although, I can't see the point of going to all this effort just to prank us. If this is another world, it would help to explain some things. Like, why hasn't there been any sign of a rescue team? Not even a helicopter. It's not like this place is that remote. It has trails, a shrine, and an old school. I don't want to hear this. Shuji falls silent after Ryo's outburst, but the implications are clear. You nailed the guess? We're talking about which one? We need to think about how we're going to get out of here. Sob. Takuma, this isn't getting us anywhere. Shuji's just crying at this point. I'm sorry. Cuckoo! Well, you heard Kuniman. I suggest we reconvene somewhere else. Yeah, and besides, I'm getting hungry. And we should hear what the girls have to say. Those are all good points. Let's ask the girls. Wait a second. Does that mean we're going to the girls' room? We're going to the cafeteria. Got a dip. Have a great stream. See you, Bleach. Thanks for popping in and hanging out. Uh, uh, this game just worries me because it's very much a visual novel and I really don't want, like, a changing scene. We're gonna go with, let's start with food. Let's start with something to eat. It's harder to think on an empty stomach. You said it, man, am I starving? Maybe by now the girls will be in the cafeteria, too. We can talk over breakfast. Oh, come to think of it, I still need to use the bathroom. Uh, you guys going ahead, okay? Why? Is something wrong, Takuma? I just need to use the bathroom. I'll be right there. <laughs> okay, you could have just said it. I'm worried. I'm worried. I'm very worried about a visual novel taking a trip to the restroom. I, I'm, I'm like, I'm, I'm, my fingers on the chat button. <laughs> well, here comes another big conversation. Sounds like it's already started, huh? My finger's on the chat button, boy. You're right. I can hear Shuji yelling something. Sounds pretty intense. Do you think something's wrong? This game. Okay, we're fine. It's just a fight. I'm... Oh, <laughs> I'm so tired, dudes. I'm telling you, it's a bad idea. We're just kids. Exploring could get us killed. We can't just sit around twiddling our thumbs, huh? We should at least look around. Indeed, fully understanding one's situation is essential for survival. I... I'm a Shuji. It's safer in here than it is out there. And I agree with Aoi. Better not to take any chances. Right. And I am not about to put any of you at risk. Oh, that's the wrong voice for him. The professor wanted me to get all of you home safe, and that's... that's what I'll do. I don't know how to make it happen yet, but we're all going back together. Shuji. That's true. No matter what we do, there's no way of knowing what might happen. Right? And if we're in danger either way, why not go and, and try and find a way home? I can see your point, but do you think it's really worth the extra risk? Any other thoughts, Ryo? <laughs> He's been like that since yesterday. Cuckoo. 
Rio's got to get over it, dude. I guess we'll take that as a no, then. Uh, Miyuki, Haru, what do you think we should do? I don't know. Don't know. Right, then. So the three of you are not voting right now. Oh, talk about good timing! Well, so far opinion's been split down the middle. What's your take on this, Takuma? You want to know what I think? Yeah. Should we scout the area or stay here and keep a low profile? I like that. Let Takuma have final say. I don't know. Seems like a big decision. Look around, look around, look around. Obviously. I think we should explore and see what we can learn. I need to make the right call. But, but what if we get attacked again? We fight back like last time. And what makes you so sure we'll win? Uh, well, I mean, he's got a point. What other option is there? You want to just sit here? What's that going to accomplish? Things could change. The monsters might vanish or maybe even leave. Yeah, well, I'd rather take my chances out there than wait around for that to happen. But we can't just head out there with nothing to go on. We'd be risking death. How long is this going to go on for? I'm bored. No need to be rude, though the conversation does seem to have reached an impasse. Okay, calm down, you two. Fighting like this isn't going to solve anything. You're right, that's why you were the tiebreaker. Why don't you both try and cool down for a bit? Yeah, I guess that's fair. Um, yes, let's do that. All right, let's all take some time to think of this over again. And we can pick things up when we get together for lunch. How's that sound? Works for me. Yes, let's do that. Then we're agreed. Let's finish breakfast, then stop for a break. Free action. Great. I want Terrier Mon. Give me Terrier Mon. No. No. <laughs> How do I get Terrier Mon? I need him in my life. That is a kind of a weird looking one though, isn't it? Like a Firemon. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know what that one is. Alright, we're gonna talk to Owie, of course. Owie is the best girl. It's Owie! What's up, Owie? Oh, Owie. Takuma. Um, uh, sorry about earlier. No, I shouldn't have gotten so flustered. Sorry, I don't know what's wrong with me. It's fine. Besides, given the circumstances, we're all a bit on edge right now. Thank you, Takuma. That was very encouraging. I approve. <laughs> Thanks. Well, now that, I'm talking, or now that I've run into Aoi, I might as well get her take on things. Where should I start? How do you feel? Well, I'm scared, worried, and pretty shaken up. Honestly, with the professor gone, I'm having a hard time staying calm. I know I need to relax more, but... There's still more. What's our next move? What do you think our next move should be? Well, we don't know how long our supplies and clothing will last. Weird thing to say. And now, I think we should focus on our basic needs. You're always so practical, Owie. Sometimes it feels like you're our mom. Stop it. I'm a worry ward. That's all. There's still more. How's our situation? It's hard to know what to make of it. After all, we're just kids with nothing to go on. I think the best thing to do is to try and stay safe until help arrives. There's still more. What's going on? So what do you think is actually going on? <sighs> Sorry, I know that's a bad answer. We're going to skip through all this, yeah? We're going to get our affinity points. We're going to get our affinity points and we're going to move along. Honestly, I wish there were a way that you could just... Oh, there is a way to skip. That's probably what I'm going to do. I'm going to skip all these scenes because, I mean, what could they honestly be about, you know? I don't think they're going to add too much to the story. Maybe if I become friends with Lotmon? Oh, there's a whole scene. Florimon, I'm Lotmon. I'm Shuji's partner. Of course. 
Well, I'm more on Saki's side. If she ever leaves, I'm going with her. <laughs> well, you sure don't beat around the bush. She doesn't seem bad, though. She helped protect those two. Naturally. Saki is very special. And I care a lot about Shuji, too. Got it. Well, it's nice to meet you both. Okay. Now for the part I don't care about. Bye. Goodbye. Don't care. How should I try to approach them? Encourage, comfort, encourage, comfort, encourage, comfort. He's just huge. He's going to be fine. Skip, 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 skip. No more? No mas. How am I going to ever have enough to say? How are you feeling? Skip, 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 skip. There's more. What's our next move? Skip, 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 skip. There's more. Now that we found a what are we gonna do with it? Get that affinity up. Where else am I even supposed to go now? Have I talked to all the people? Rio. It kind of feels disingenuous. Rio is not doing well, dude. Oh, they shifted. Okay, cool. Let's go to the other area. No! All I want is my boy. All I've ever wanted is my boy. What do I have to do to unlock my boy? Oh, that was fast. Help him. Five moves left. I wonder what happens if you befriend them. Oh, we got an item. That's kind of fun. Oh, did it adjust now again? Who is that second one? Like a shark? Not Terriermon?
Well, they sure did give me a bunch of options, huh? I guess it's Minoru or Bust. Gotta have faith, faith, faith. So I think Falcomon's gone missing. That's probably not great. What's up, Kunamon? Wait, what's up? Did Kunamon just talk? Oh no. Look, I just gotta ask him questions. Where are you going? There's more! There's more! So I guess all of our Digimons are missing? I guess I probably should have been paying attention this whole time, huh? There's more! We gonna learn today. Oh, it's all my friends. A suspicious thicket. Come on. Ah, welcome to the party, buddy. <gasps> Lotmon. I thought I thought I th thought for a second that was my boy. But it wasn't. Well, rats. All I want is my boy. Nerd Pastor Nate, when were you going to tell me that Labor Day is next Monday? I was, in fact, never going to tell you. I honestly forgot about it myself. We, uh, My wife and I were talking about going to the beach for Labor Day. And then we were like, yeah, that's a couple weeks away. Nope. Sure isn't. It's right now, baby. All right, the story starts at last. Whoa, whoa! I think the story starts now. A radio? We found a radio. You mean a radio tower? I learned from another streamer. How about that? Yeah, it snuck up on us this, this season. Okay, so we just found a radio tower. I quickly got everyone together, and they were all thrilled by Agumon's discovery. The tower sends cell signals too, right? If we go there, our phones might start working. And I bet from a tall building like that, we could get a great view of our surroundings. Just how tall is it? It's super tall! Falcomon, you saw it too, right? How tall would you say it was? Well, it's hard to say with no comparison, but it was taller than the school. If it's that big, there's no doubt. Do you think it's working? That I do not know. After all, none of us have even heard of these towers before. Maybe if we went there, we could find out. Who knows? Maybe there's someone there. Yeah, sitting around talking about it isn't going to do us much good. Then it sounds like we're in for a hike. Let's do this, Owie. A hike? What do you mean? What kind of hike? Oh, you don't know? The tower is on top of a mountain, through the forest, and over a mountain, fa mountain pass. Wait, you mean we need to go through the forest? You can't be serious. The place is crawling with monsters. Just exploring around here would be risky. Do you want to climb a mountain? There's no way we should stay here. Yuji, you don't have to get so upset. Shut up. I don't want to hear another word from you. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Nothing we do matters. Cool. Say what you want, Yuji, but nothing's going to change if we just stay here. What can a bunch of kids do? We need to wait for the adults to come rescue us. As if anyone's coming. <laughs> Yeah, Shuji, you said it yourself. Nobody's coming for us. I never said that. Not out loud. If I did, th that might make it come true. 
Even knowing there wasn't much chance of a rescue, none really, Shuji still hoped. Hmm. I'm, I'm going with you, Labramon. Will you come with me? You bet I will, Owie. What, Owie? I thought you agreed we should stay here. If, if that tower has a cell signal, that would mean we could contact a teacher. We could talk to everyone, even call for help. C call for help? Yes, and then wait to be rescued. Are you really still against this, Shuji? You tell him, Owie, and hey, that means now a majority of us want to go explore. I'm interested in this tower, too. That puts me, Minoru, Saki, and Owie in favor of going. I haven't even planned out my message for tomorrow. I am speaking on... You talking about on stream? So what now, Shuji? But no. I got the songs planned out, but that's out. I gotcha. Shuji must really not want to go back out there if he's still not convinced. If only there was some way to win him over. Uh, why was he so opposed to exploration? Because we might get attacked. Men's group I lead on Discord. Oh, that's awesome. Why was he so opposed? He's opposed because we might get attacked. Agumon, did you spot anything that seemed dangerous or might attack us on the way? Not to worry, we didn't get attacked once. I didn't even catch a whiff of anything suspicious either. So it's not dangerous? Sounds like a no-brainer. You really think it's safe? I guess in that case. <sighs> if you all want to go, I guess there's no point in me trying to stop you. Okay, everybody. Bye. Bye. What are you two talking about? You're coming with us. But what will you do if a monster attacks and it's just the two of you? But let's not forget, neither of you have a partner monster. Indeed, we will not let any harm come to you. And I'll keep you safe, too. Never one to be left out, are you? Yeah, Agumon's like this all the time. Oh, and Ryo, we'll look after the place while you're gone, right? Wait, don't leave me behind. I'm going too, okay? Oh, come on, Ryo. How can you be so uncooperative if you can't handle being on your own? Uh, it's all right. At least he's finally back to being Ryo we know. He's been a little off lately, but the guy is supposed to be bitter and crabby. Ryo is definitely the most surface-level character I've ever seen. He ain't got a thing to him. Following directions from Agumon and the others, we emerge onto a mountain path. It's a mountain path! <clears throat> Hard to believe this place was right here, so close to the school. Yeah, it's just a little to the left of the shrine, yet it feels so different. We're a big group, and Haru's a little kid, but we still made it in under an hour. I got a busy week this week. On Thursday, I'm having Derek White on my stream, talking about the documentary and his walk of faith. That's awesome! This drop goes really far down. It's not too deep. It's going to be a really nasty fall. We love Derek here. Hey, look, there's a huge bridge over there. Wow, that's enormous. I've never seen anything like it before. Not this again. Can't you give it a rest? Uh, what do you mean, give what a rest? Agumon keeps talking about how he wants to be like all the stuff he sees. Yeah, I want to be super big, just like that bridge. You see what I mean? <laughs> you guys are funny like that. Yes, I am excited, and last I heard, he may be at LTNCon. They need to confirm whether he will be there. For sure, I would love to see him there. Don't you think it's weird, Takuma? Yeah, though it's hardly the only strange thing about them. You got me there. The fact that they even exist is pretty strange. <laughs> You're too kind. That wasn't a compliment. I've been having so much fun with Florimon and the others that it's easy to forget. But we still really don't have any idea what they are. Yeah, that's the kind of question I wish the professor were here to answer. He wouldn't know! Not that I can say that in front of Saki. I do know they'll be doing a screening. Yes, I heard that as well. It's huge. Love it. Just the movie's on the schedule right now, Zando. You all right, Rio? If we get attacked here this time, this time I'm dead. It's okay. I don't sense anything dangerous nearby. Hey, shut up. Leave me alone. Cool. Like you even care what happens to me. Just go on and leave me alone. That's not going to happen. We're not leaving anyone behind. That's what the professor wanted, so I, I owe that to him too. Yeah, I feel the same way. We're not about to just leave you alone. I don't want to lose another person the way we lost the professor. Just shut up. I think he might die. Because he has no, no story to him. And now he's back to mumbling under his breath again. At least he's keeping pace. 
Hopefully that's a good sign. Ooh. All right, that's close enough. That's enough slices. We've covered quite the distance. That tower's on top of this mountain, right? It sure is. Hmm, look, there's someone over there. Is that? <gasps> Kaito! And a strange white-haired person. What? It's Kaito. It is. Oh, what a relief. I'm so glad he's okay. You knew him for three minutes. Hmm, wait, there's someone with him. Who could that be? We've literally never seen her before. I can't be coming up with another voice, you guys. This is... I'm at my limit of voices. You, what did you do with Mew? And you better give me a straight answer or you're not going to like what happens next. Hmm, when will you get it through your skull that I don't have to tell you anything? Why, you little fine, you asked for this. Kaido. Huh? Hmm. Kaido, you're all right. It's so good to see you. Guys, help me out, this lady. Help, please. This boy came out of nowhere and started screaming at me. I don't know why. Stop lying. I know you're a monster in disguise. Kaido, stop. What's going on? Is she a Digimon? Are there Digi-humans now? <clears throat> I'm gonna cough. <coughs> oh, Drogmon's super cool. <coughs> I'm so sorry. Hmm. Water went down the wrong way. Oh no, he's Kaido's. <coughs> hmm. I don't know why I thought Kaido was gonna have a Gabumon. Man, that water really messed me up. I almost drowned myself. Hey, nice to meet you. I'm Drogmon, Kaido's partner. I'm Agumon, Takuma's partner. And I'm Takuma. Nice to meet you. Pleasure's all mine. No, I better explain why things are so messed up. Kaido and you were going through the forest together. Then Kaido went to scout ahead. He came back and Mew was gone. So he started looking for her. And this is where I come in. Drakmon offered to help right away. So he knew he must be alright. Wow, that was kind of snap judgment. Although I guess it worked out this time. Anyway, I started helping Kaido look for Mew, and then that human woman showed up. Yeah, you can't really censor like you can the rest of us. True, but some of us can mask our presence, and I'm not sure you can go by that. So what are you what are you going by? Instinct. And I trust Kaido, which means I trust his instinct though. But is that really good enough? What if you're wrong? Then we can just apologize. Well, I guess that's one way of looking at it. Unfamiliar woman. I was out walking not far from my house. Then suddenly I was surrounded by a strange fog, and the next thing I knew I was lost. Not just lost, I was somewhere I'd never been before. I kept walking until I saw this boy. And for this purse, it was lying by the path. I was going to return it if I found the owner. Checking the website now, and Derek may be there. That would be awesome if he was. <laughs> Nothing sounds that off to me. Me, ne me neither. The fact that she has Mew's purse is off. Kaido, relax. Could you please stay quiet for just a minute? The one thing that she does seem strange to me is her ability to be safe without a monster. Monster? What do you mean, monster? Who are you calling a monster? Oh, my. Ooh, what could that be? Hmm? That seemed more like an act than natural surprise. Am I signed up for the documentary screening? I don't think I'm signed up for anything yet. I've not registered for a single thing. Maybe I'm overthinking it. Uh, uh, uh. Hmm? What is it, Ryo? Mommy? Um, excuse me? Uh, she reminds me of my mother. She's a good person, I'm sure of it. I think he's gonna die. I think Ryo might be bow to die. Oh dear. <laughs> oh man. I think he's been ensnared by this digi woman. And he's not going to be okay. Right. Rio, buddy. <laughs> we need to talk, my dude. <laughs> We're going to need to have a chat. 
This woman just showed up and started talking to me, and she was holding Mew's purse. Oh, yeah? What about Mew? You're right. I don't see her anywhere. Where is she? I don't know. We stayed together for a while, then I left for one second, and she was gone. That's awful. Then this woman comes out of nowhere with some of Mew's stuff. That does seem suspicious, but why call her a monster in disguise? Everything we've met so far has been a monster. What makes you think she's not? We don't know what you've been through, nor do you know what we've been through. We just met back up, Kaido. I'm not sure that's logical. You see, he's convinced, and I don't know what to do. I only spoke to him because he's the only soul I saw nearby. Well, what say you? Don't tell me you're buying that bull. Hmm. Saki Yamanoru. Everybody's got something to say, don't they? Kaido and that woman are saying completely different things. Whose story do we trust? Hmm, why don't we ask about the woman's story? Why do you suggest that? Just a feeling, you know. Besides, it's not like there are any holes in her story. More importantly, I can't stand how Kaido refuses to listen. He keeps going on and on about not trusting her. It's like he's got tunnel vision. Ugh. That's a funny face you're making, Saki. All scratched up. Oh, come on. Don't look at me when I get like this. Well, I do see what you're saying. Uh oh, didn't mean to talk to you. Sorry, Minoru. All right, I guess we have to hear more of her story. Ooh, unfamiliar woman. All right, I missed all this. That woman is totally suspicious. Don't you trust her? Hmm, how can I clear things up for you? I believe you. Well then, <laughs> thank you. Yes, mommy. <laughs> I'm telling you, dude, he's dead. <laughs> he's <laughs> Man, he's a goner. Look, Minoru, or look, Kaido, if you can't trust her, what's the alternative? Could you lay it out for us? What? Don't give me that. If you screw with me, I'll mess you up. Quit snapping at people. See, this is the problem with you, Kaido. You refuse to budge and just harass people until you get your way. Not comfortable without often saying mommy. For real. I registered for the MK8 tourney and then realized the only scheduled D&D games at the same time and I decided my soul needs D&D more, needs D &D more than Mario Kart. We'll get plenty of other time to hang out, Zando. Don't worry. Uh, I don't want to hear this. This isn't about my problems, okay? Please stop fighting. No, uh, mommy. No, we need my mom. Kaido and that woman are saying completely different things. Who's already trust? Well, if you ask me, we should. Oh, <laughs> this voice am I even doing now? If you ask me, we should talk more with that woman. Why is that? I mean, just look at her. Man, she even smells nice. She's luring us in. Hey, Minoru, you look funny. Your face is all red. Minoru, be serious. I am serious. It's not like I'm deciding based on looks because I'm so confused. Uh, right. Okay, I see where you're coming from. I don't like it. Oop. Oh, hey, Owie. Kaido and the women are saying, well, I think we should hear more from Kaido. Good thinking, Owie. That's just what we should do. Okay, th is this all they're going to say? Okay. This this could be such so much better. I don't I don't need to... Okay. Kaido, can we hear more of your story now? I don't know. Doubting her seems like... Seem, doubting her because she had some amused stuff seems kind of no real flimsy. Kaido, are you sure you aren't jumping to conclusions? What about what she has to say? Oh, come on, guys. Takuma, you must be able to see that something's not quite right here. Um, well, I don't think we know enough yet to say for sure. Wait, hold on a minute. Didn't the professor say only children get offered as sacrifices? And if so, doesn't that make it strange for there to be an adult here? Hmm. Yeah, you're right. I'm not so sure. I mean, the sacrifices might not have anything to do with this. Besides, the professor brought it here, was brought here as an adult. Maybe it's not that strange. All oh, right. Hmm. Who cares about some random disappearances? She did something to me. You. This is getting so old. Would you give it a rest? All right, Shuji. Should I talk to Kaido more? I bet I should. I bet I should. I bet I should. What do you think? Should I talk more? Probably. You probably do think that. You monster, what did you do with Mew? I keep trying to tell you, I don't know. Cut the crap, admit it! You kidnapped her, didn't you? Please don't hurt me! Kaito, stop, what is wrong with you? There's no need to resort to violence. Here, help me stop Kaito! I can't remember any of these voices, dude. I'm losing my mind. Right! 
Let go of me, she took her, she took Mew! He or even if she didn't, she knows something! Enough, you need to calm down. Kaido, there's no need to hurt anyone, relax! Fine, I'll stop. Let go of me. What a relief. Them all talk like the adults in the Peanuts cartoon. <laughs> Make them all talk like it. Wah, 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 wah. Any scene I want to skip, I will from now on. <laughs> yeah, clearly she's the bad person, but it's not going to let me do it, is it? Because she's got to kidnap Rio and eat him or something. Rio's dead, dude. There's no doubt in my mind. Oh, what was his voice? All right, everybody. Chatting's nice and all, but how much time have you got to spare? Yeah, we should really be getting to the tower. What about you, Kaido? I've got to find Mew. So come on, let's get this over with. Did he just punch her? Relax, you don't have to get so worked up over every little thing. What an incorrigible brute. You said it. What do we do? I mean, it's either we believe Kaido or this woman, right? She's right. Mammy's right. <laughs> Speaking of which, I realize I never got burly Pikachu reading poetry. You're right. Cuckoo. To be honest, I'm not sure how much I trust her. But if she knows the way to the tower, it'd be great if she could show us. That's a good point. Regardless of who we believe, we have to keep our goal in mind. Yeah, it'd be great to have a guide. After all, I'd hate to get lost out here. But didn't Agumon and the others already make it up there? What? Oh, I don't know the way. You don't? I apologize if we misled you, but we only saw the tower from afar. You mean we could have gotten lost at any time? That just makes it even better. Now we can have her show us the way. Yeah, let's do that. We sure don't want to get lost. What, you actually trust this liar? That's the monster that kidnapped you. I'm telling you, you've got it all wrong. I don't think we do. Oh, great. Here we go again. Takuma, I think it's time we made a decision. Right. The woman knows the way to the tower, but she does seem kind of suspicious. Kaido's a friend, but he's not making much sense and seems pretty hung up about Mew. Who should I believe? All right, I'm obviously going to believe Kaido. Or maybe I should have us vote. Do you guys want to vote? I'll do a poll while I pull up Pikachu. While I pull up a poem for Burly Pikachu. Let's see. Where is a poll? New poll. Who to believe? Kaido, whoopsie, Keisho, <laughs> or woman. I'll set a one minute timer. Get your votes in. Let me know what you think while I get Pikachu pulled up. All right, this is new names for lost things. Um, I guess it doesn't really matter which poem I pick, <laughs> but I'll keep looking for one that's super short. All right, Forget Me Not uh, by Nor Unahar from the collection of poems, New Names for Lost Things, as read by a burly Pikachu. Pikachu. Pikachu, Pikachu. Pikachu. Pika... Pika -pi. Pikachu. Pikachu, Pika. Pikachu, Pikachu. Pika P, Pika. Pika P. Chats in the cloud, please. By the way, I did read all those inflections completely properly, just so you know. You said trust the woman, huh? All right. All right. I guess we're trusting the woman and getting Rio eaten. I guess we're getting Rio eaten. Okay. Mammy! I'm trusting Mammy! Oh, Mammy! Oh, Mammy! You guys just don't get it. Whatever. I'll find you, even if that means I have to do it alone. So long, then. Not the decision I would have made, but all right. Hey, wait! You can't just leave! Hmm? Miyuki. Oh, okay. What is going on? My sister and I are going that way too. We made the wrong choice. <laughs> we made the wrong choice. Turn back. Turn back. Oh man. What are we gonna do? <laughs> hey, wait, you two shouldn't be alone. Don't worry, we'll be with Kaito. 
Nature going, ah! Wrong choice, bye. The two all-knowing NPCs decided they were going somewhere else. Well, there they go. Are they really going to be all right? If they're headed that way, they'll end up in the same spot. That's just the long way. Don't worry, I'm sure it'll all work out in the end. That smile right there makes me know she's the bad person, right? Hmm, she seems different all of a sudden, or maybe not, I don't know. That's a relief, we can all meet up again at the tower. Yeah, it sounds like this way we can take our time. That was the right choice. Indeed, I am also curious about this cable car. I feel like I'm missing conversation somewhere. Oh yeah, I can't wait, let's go. Nobody ever said anything about a cable car. If I lay here. Wow, it's an actual cable car. What a curious device. Wow, it goes all the way to the top. This looks like it's the platform for the cable car, but it's pretty beat up. It looks every bit as run down and decrepit as that school. Is this thing actually working? The cars run automatically on a schedule. One should be here soon. They run automatically? Are you sure that's safe? I'd hate for it to snap part way up. What? There's no way I'm getting on that thing. The cable car goes pretty high up on its own way to the top. Any fall would be deadly. Yeah, a fall from that high and even I'd be done for. We could fall? That would be terrible. We better not ride it. Thanks for your lurk, Perry. Don't worry, the cars and the cable are both quite sturdy. Nothing's ever broken them. Phew, that's a relief. You guys are quick to trust. All right. Is there no one else here? I'd expect there to at least be a maintenance worker. No, I've never found anyone else. Is that a problem? No, it was just something I was wondering about. Oh, you're not still suspicious, are you? You can see she's been telling the truth. Isn't it about time we started trusting her? I'm not so sure. Well, just look at Rhea. <laughs> <laughs> Can we not? Can we not look at Rio? Can we just ignore Rio, actually? He seems to have warmed right up to her. Mammy! <laughs> oh my. <laughs> cool. See, what's, what's not to trust? She's been nothing but helpful. And that's after the way Kaido treated her. She's got to be really nice. Well, I suppose. She does seem nice, like Minoru says. But I'm concerned about how Rio is acting. <laughs> What'd she say so, Takuma? Takuma's a little concerned. Okay. <laughs> what do I think about this woman? I do not trust her. Something about that woman just isn't right. You think so too, Takuma? Yeah. She talked about that cable car like she'd been studying it for a while. And she didn't think it was strange for it to be running by itself. That seems weird. That conversation is way over my head. Yeah, I don't get it either, but I'm sure Aoi is right. It's not really that complicated. We're just saying we don't trust that woman. But if we question her about anything, I'm sure she'll just put on another act. We need to be ready for anything. Whenever the others do, let's stay on our guard. Agreed. Okay, everyone, the car's here. It's me, definitely a woman. I've not given you my name yet, and that's not weird. And I'm wearing high heels and a jumpsuit. <laughs> wow, this is a cable car. It's so cool. I've never ridden on a cable car before. This is kind of exciting. Get in, everybody. This will take us straight to the tower. Why? Why the zoom in on the mouth? <laughs> Why the weird zoom in on the mouth? <laughs> Mammy. <laughs> He's gotta stop, dude! He's gotta stop! It seems so spacious at first, but with this many people, it still feels cramped. And I didn't realize how high up it goes. Maybe I'd better not look down. Wow, we're up so high. Woohoo! Oh, let me look too! Hey, we're not here for the fun of it. Let's try to stay alert. Oh, relax, Shuji. We're practically there. What's the harm in having a little fun? <gasps> we got the hiccups. But, but... Disaster can strike at any moment. We must remain vigilant. No, you're so strict. Don't you get tired being on high alert all the time? I hate heights. <laughs> it's alright, everyone. We're almost there. I can't figure out her voice. 
It doesn't really matter because she's just evil. When we get to the tower, our cell phone should work, and then we can call for help. And this whole wilderness <laughs> and this whole wilderness survival nightmare will finally be over. Yes, soon it will all be over. Uh, what? The radio tower is up and running, isn't it? Why didn't you stick around there? Why, indeed. <laughs> <laughs> so evil, why did you choose it? I didn't! You guys did! Huh? What are you... If you want something done right, I suppose you must do it yourself. Huh? D did you just... You know, I really am grateful to all of you. I feel like I should thank you. <laughs> Don't mention it. Honestly, I'm not even sure why'd you feel that way. No, oh, because even if that one little brat got away, now you're all here instead. And there are so many of you. I can't thank you enough. What's gotten into you? I don't get it. <laughs> don't worry. I'll be sure to catch your other little friend, too. <laughs> Mommy? <laughs> Mommy? Mommy, what you saying, Mommy? Although, I suppose, this is the end of the line for you. What is about to happen? Uh? What was that? Why do we start swinging? The sudden motion knocked us all around! Is everyone okay? What happened? I feel dizzy. I hit my head. It seems like nobody has any major injuries. Uh, is it just me or does something seem wrong? The car. It's not moving. Are we in the fog? I don't like this. A minute ago everything was going great. Now it's too quiet. That woman, she's gone! What? Seriously? So is Rio, right? What was that sound? Uh, yeah. Rio, behind you. Uh. <laughs> Spider Woman. Something was out there, staring in at us through the window. That face is scary, dude. Its eyes glittering like a predator, eager to devour its prey. Mommy! <laughs> Trapped inside the cable car by the fray, we could do little more than scream. Ah! A spider again? What is that thing? A demon? A demon spider woman? No, no, no! It's huge! Where'd this monster even come from? What happened to that woman? You guys are so dense! Not very bright, are you? Or was my disguise just that good? Don't you know better than to trust a stranger? She's smiling. So creepy. I am Eric Kinemon. Don't worry, you won't need to remember my name for long. Because you're all about to die! Oh, yes. I will offer up everyone in this box as sacrifices. Oh no, what are we gonna do, Shuji? This is why I didn't want to go exploring. I'm scared. No, no, mommy. That's not, that's not my mommy. Of course not, <laughs> of course not. Mommy's not here. What is going on with Rio, dude? Rio's gone and lost his mind. <gasps> Man, now I have to take care of these little brats. I'm looking from you. <laughs> yeah, what's the problem with them keeping you company? You won't be so lonely. Who said I was lonely? Oh, Miyuki, what is it? Hey, what's the holdup? If you can't keep up, I'll just leave you behind. Hmm, what are you staring at, little girl? 
Yeah, seriously, what is it? It looks like a cable car by the fray. Need to stop part way up. It looks like everyone's trapped inside. Wait, so this was all that woman's plan? <laughs> I knew she was a monster. What I tell you? What's going to happen to them? <laughs> Fine, I'll go save them. You two find somewhere to hide and wait there. Come on, Drachman. You got it. I got eyes on my hands. Got eyes in my palms. Things I know about Digimon. One, you can't Digivolve without eating dinner. Two, the woman is the most trustworthy person I've ever seen. Yep. So trustworthy. So how would she have tricked us if we hadn't agreed to go along with her plan? She was spooky looking behind his head, wasn't she? That kind of reminded me of that scene from Insidious. You're the reason this whole world is falling apart. But by sacrificing human children, we can prevent its destruction and we will be saved. I might have thought all might be lost when that little girl with the hat got away. But now I can offer up all of you instead. So you show your true face at last. Took your time toying with us, didn't you? Well, get ready for this, you overgrown arachnid. Let's go, Drachmon. About time. Do I have to wait for him to learn to Digivolve, or can he just d d do it? Oh! Oh, nice! I can pull from my, uh... From my other friends, yeah? Call them on. Call them on and buy them on. Why not? Start battle. Battle start! All right, we gotta beat our Kinemon. A little help here. What a pain. Hold your horses, we're coming to help. Can I just walk on the trees? Or is there spider web? I'm closest, so I guess I'm up first. Let me at him. It is kind of nice that they let us add in two other digis. Dude, nice! Sangloopmon! I guess I'll wait until I get a little closer, yeah? Not bad, Drachmon. Of course, I'll take down any enemy! <laughs> That's definitely that voice. Right, Biomon! Come on. What is that? What was that thing? The Digivolution is up and coming. Can you see? Can you hear? Did you know what's coming? Blade Wolf. Thanks for the lurk, Quit. What's up? Well, I guess you just lurked, so what's up is that you cannot respond to what I just said. We're glad you're here. Thanks for lurking, friend. Appreciate ya. Nice, Biomon. Killing it. Oh. Oopsie doopsie. Oh, 
I want to know what that thing is. It'd probably be helpful. It'd probably be helpful to digivolve for this battle, as I also did earlier. I knew you need dinner. We do indeed. Got chop on. Good job on, Dave. Got chop on. Oh, sir. <laughs> Thanks, coach. That sounds like a chaos emerald if I've ever heard one. I'm gonna go out on a limb and say this is a Chaos Emerald in here. It is, it's the blue one! The first Chaos Emerald. Boink. The blue Chaos Emerald has been got. Let's get some beans. Let's get some beans. Not close enough. The wait continues. I don't even see that box right there. That's very funny. I assume I need to go help my friends. I hope I'm not just wasting time here. Although this game could pretty much be called the wasting time simulator. The takes too long simulator. The get ready to stare at the screen for long amounts of time simulator. I've already had my one bean. I, I'm so glad there's already a bean out of the way. That's one less bean that I have to consume later. I'm celebrating it. A rear attack really stinks, but at least it's moving towards me. I would really like to not be poisoned. That sounds really fun. Oh my goodness, there's gotta be a way to speed up these battles. There's got to be a way. This is so long. There simply must be a way to speed up the battles. They are so slow. Like ZR or something. Something has got to speed up these battles. They are just painfully slow. You work so hard to get there. 
to actually experience some story. Why did that do like no damage? Of course. Of course, I don't have any of my special move left. Maybe Gum Mind can heal. I say I gotta be within four. I doubt I'm that close. I mean, like, over on the D-pad. Remember playing 95% of Omori without knowing you could run? There's gotta be a way, dude. There simply must. And I'm just too doofy to know how to do it. Cures abnormalities. Am I still poisoned? Doesn't look like it. not survived a single round. Do you know that? Does at least a bigger chunk. I'm about to lose my evolution, though. Oh good, he's weak to it. I mean, I'm holding X, I'm holding Y. I thought he was going to one-hit him and I was going to be furious. Back attack! Still don't know what those little floating orbs are. Oh, I probably should have moved to the side, huh? Oopsie. It's okay, I killed him anyway. Alright, now can I go free my friends? I thought it was done for! Thanks for the save! Yes! 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 A burning and a burning and a burning and a burning and a burning Okay, we also brought some more bad guys with us. Good. Let's make this match a little longer. 
I, for one, would like to see this go on longer. You think I could just rush homegirl up here? Do I even need to take on these baddies? Need me to calm down, I'm having too much fun. It's not even having fun or not having fun, it's just... I needed to speed up! This will be a, a great game to play with a podcast on in the background. Or a YouTube video or something. What's up? How we doing, Action Ninja? How we doing? Did y'all just hop off a stream? Or have y'all not started your stream yet for the day? We're just enjoying some invigorating gameplay. Definitely not incredibly slow paced. What's up, H Man? We need a name for you guys. The instead of the early gang, y'all are the last minute gang. Although you still have 30 minutes, so it's not that late, but. The definitely not early gang. How were your weekends? How the, how the, how the weekend treat you? Finished and rated out to a beautiful singer. Our stream was fun. Played a demo for a really, really indie game. That was the most indie game. Tell me more about it. What indie game was it? I got a lot of games on my backlog right now, so I'd love to hear more. Oh, of course. Good. She had guards. We can call them the back nine. Ooh, I like that. That's nice. Why can't I? Why can't I climb? Is it too tall? It just looks like one. It just looks like one elevation. Is one elevation too much for realsies? I guess we'll digivolve to go up a one elevation. To make this a little longer. There we go. This game, dude. Free ride. Still a super beta play test, but the conceit is cool. Play the game as usual, and then it does a secret personality test on you based on what you do. That's very cool. Got some of the daycare crud, so I'm taking a sick day. Oh, get used to it, my friend. Daycare crud. Welcome to the life. Free ride. Take it easy. Free ride. All right, let's go ahead and evolve Agumon too. Just gonna digivolve everybody. D I was fine, and then around 4 a.m. it hit me super hard. Oof, that's awful, man. I do know it well. We're going through potty regression and a growth spurt, so I got no sleep last night. Okay, bro, I want to chat, but I got to edit, and my tiny brain can't do two things at one. Have a good stream. See ya, XG Ninja. Thanks for joining us. Appreciate ya. I think Gomamon might just die. <laughs> <laughs> Come on! I'm so sorry, buddy! You can't climb! <laughs> you can't climb! They're just gonna leave you alone, dude! This is so pitiful! I'm so sorry, little guy! Oh my goodness, he's going miserably. And miserably slow. Maybe there's like a setting? Let's see if there's a setting. Win, auto, suspend, give up, retry, display, no. None of them. I guess I could do auto battle. My thoughts on this game are that I love visual novels, and I think that I would really like to play it for that reason. Um, it is not the best game. Not the best game to play on a stream, I think. Not that I'm not enjoying it. 
but it is a lot to read. Uh, so you gotta want to read the visual novel part. And then whenever you get into the actual gameplay part, it's just very, very slow. Like they keep all the digi animations in. The maps are huge. Maps are so big. Like, why does this map need to be this big? There is no reason for it to take many turns for me to get to these baddies. Multiple turns to get to the baddie. I think that's about where I'm at. Too many turns to get to the baddies. I don't want to waste my Digivolution. Maybe I'm super late to the obvious party, but is XG Ninja supposed to be Christian Ninja like Xmas and Christmas? Sure. I'm sure you can say either one of those. I would also say Xmas. I feel kind of bad for Gummon. I started playing the Pokemon card game this week. That's very fun. Are you enjoying it? It's a great game. Let's see, neither way can I get them from a side attack, huh? I'm so sorry, going on, buddy. Beyond my Yeah, I knew, I knew what you meant. Because I remember you talking with Zando about it. It feels like a simplified MTG, but it's keeping my interest. It's very much, it's very much in the same vein, isn't it? Yeah. As I said. I think that is verbatim what I said. It's very much, if you like magic, you're gonna like Pokemans. I already plan on logging in next week, so we can always play it next week, you guys, if you want. Like, what are those little floating things there for? They're just taking my time. That is so much damage! Are you kidding? Is that a joke? I don't think that was a joke. I am not doing this fight again. Absolutely not. Did you see how much damage she just did? What is actually happening? All right, well, all eyes on her, dude. All eyes on her. She's got to go. I made a whoopsie by de-digivolving. Because she's got to go and fast if she does 600 damage every hit. She is not allowed to stick around. Ugh. I don't think there's any of them that are close enough. Maybe that one. Nope. None of them are close enough. Look, I don't wanna I don't wanna nitpick gameplay, but maybe you shouldn't have trusted this lady. I don't I don't know what would have happened. Would she have just fought us right there? Also, what happens if you lose a fight? I don't know that. Move faster! Why is this taking so long? Move! Move faster! One shot! One shot, my Agumon! It's taking so long to get wrecked. <laughs> 
I, I'm fine if you. Oh, that's not who I meant to fight. No. Oh. Look, if you want to get, if, I, if you want to wreck me, that's fine. It's fine. But do it quicker than this. I don't even know if I can reach her. It's just draining how long this takes. Like, what was that? One hit? Oh, wow, she survived a single round. Maybe by some miracle we can take her down. I have no idea why we just dropped. No clue. We just dropped for no apparent reason. I checked on my internet, it's fine. Okay, good, I can restart battle. No, I don't need to change the difficulty, but I could change the speed if you don't mind. I would be I would be totally content changing the speed. Do you think that might be an option? Can we change the pace of the game? Maybe just go to my my action every time. Maybe I don't need to see them. I'm going to google it. Speed up battle Digimon survive. Change the battle speed settings. Oh man, in the system settings. Oh, beautiful, 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 beautiful. Yeah, Spider Mommy is not happy with us and that's all well and good. Okay, we're gonna go so much faster. Oh, yes. Oh, I cannot wait. Cannot wait for this game to move a little quicker. Okay. So, knowing what I know now, Biomon is not really gonna be any help. I'm gonna do, I'm probably gonna do Gummon and this Fishmon, Betamon, whatever they move. Start battle. Start battle! Yes, yes, I know, I know. I know, I know, I know all of this. I know all of this. Like, why Why do you think start bat needs to be that long? Okay. Let's go to settings. Oh, wow. Wow, 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 dude, three times! Oh, yes! Oh, and I can turn off skill animations? Wait. No skill animations off? Do I want no skill animations on? Why is it no skill? I think that, I think that means it turns on not showing the skill animation. Right? Have I lost my marbles? Oh. Wow, this is beautiful. Guys, this is this is amazing. 
Look at how fast it's going. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Yes. Oh, my. Oh, gorgeous. It is simply gorgeous. Look at how fast they're going. It's already my turn again. Isn't this amazing? What are those? Okay, my boy's poisoned. I'm gonna go ahead and digivolve him. It's a pretty good chunk of damage. Oh, wow, dude. I can't reach him. You're kidding me. Oh, wow. Okay, good. Betamon can, but he probably can't take him down. <laughs> You're kidding. Still not gonna kill him. And he missed! No! What if they just kill Drachmon on the first round? You guys, I hate to say this, but this might be our last time playing Digimon Survive on stream. I really wanted to get a Terriermon on stream, but... It's just too slow of a game. There's so much reading. It's so slow. I'm free, and someone is covering my shift tonight, so I don't have to work tonight. Oh, wonderful! Well, there you go. So you get a little break. That's very nice. Very nice. Good friends. We love a good, helpful friend. It's always hard to tell what stream is into, too. I can't tell if you guys are into this game or not. It's very tricky. I want everybody to be having a good time, you know? It's crucial. It's crucial! Keeping an eye on it, but also been in work meetings. Oh, you're all good. You're all good. And if you are enjoying it, just tell me. I can keep playing it. But I could also just as easily play it on my own time. If peeps aren't digging it. I'm here for the memes and clippable moments. There's plenty of those. Man, that professor dying, I'll still never get over. So close. Raid suggestion if they're still going is redeemed J09. You got it. Can do. Oof. That was brutal. Nice. 
I don't think I can reach. Nope. Oh, come on! Thank you. I'll take that. Man, they love picking on my boy, don't they? Now we got to go through all the turns again. Everybody gets a turn, of course. Okay, and then we get to close in a little bit of the gap. Not much of the gap. Not enough to be meaningful. Just enough. not a lot of damage really does not do a lot of damage I mean, I really just cannot imagine a much slower experience. I don't want to be hard on this game because I love Digimon. But this is just, it's painful. Even with the battle speed turned all the way up. I mean, how long have we been going now? On this one battle. This uneventful battle where really not much has happened. Yeah, we saved everybody. Good job. Now they slowly drop them out. <laughs> like, why? Why is Digimon survive? Trombone. And I really want to enjoy it. Okay. Let's go ahead and hide. Hide in the embraces of our friends. Let's use an item. No, wrong way. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, at long last, we're back to where we were last time. This time, we're gonna take down all the friends. He should probably devolve for a couple rounds. Then I'm gonna let him just chill there. Now we're gonna bring our other friends over here to save the day. 
course, we're not going to digivolve yet because it's still going to take another four or five turns until they get over here. I certainly wouldn't want to waste any of my digivolve time. We're just going to let them close the gap a little bit. And he did. Here comes the other one. Still just watching. Whatever that circle thing is, is just watching. Okay, now we're cooking with grease. Let's let some other Digimans have a turn, huh? Wow, one hit. How you like them apples? Go ahead and start making progress. See, she can heal. Cure liqueur gumamon. Nice. Agumon, you really don't even need to digivolve for this one. Gomamon should be able to one-shot it now. Beautiful. Now, Betamon, I don't think, can get up here. So they might be kind of stuck. and undigivolve. We don't waste our SP. And then we're going to move. No. You have to digivolve to move. You got to re-digivolve you before we move you back up here. Same with the rest of us. Everybody's got a Digivolve now. Except for Falcomon. We're going to let Gummamon, Agumon, and Betamon all try and get up the wall. I don't remember if this cues them or not. If it does, that's a bummer. If it does, that's a bummer. Okay. Well, just because they're cute doesn't necessarily mean they'll come after us. I hope. Okay, this one's going to close the... Nope, that one's not going to close the gap. For reasons we'll never know. It's Pepper Breath. That ribs. Oh, no, it's a Venom Trap. Neat. What's that mean? Bait him on! Beta. Still just the weird circle thingy watching us. Alright, you know what? Actually, we're gonna de digivolve until everybody gets together. And hopefully that'll just be okay. I just wanna be okay, be okay, be okay. I just wanna be okay today. I just wanna be okay, be okay, be okay. I just wanna be okay today. Just give me back my pieces. Uh, what? No! 
Don't you dare run away from me! Don't you dare run away from me right now! This had better be a joke! Why are they making this take so long? This game is gonna take like 47 turns. No. Why don't you go one step further? And you can D Digivolve until Agumon gets here. I'm not sending you all in by your lonesome. You! You, dude! <laughs> what is happening? I will chase him to the ends of the earth. I will waste every bit of Digivolution that I have. None shall escape. You can't hide from me. I will waste every single turn of this game hunting you down. I do literally like no damage to you. I am a champion of the Digimon variety. And it is as if I am, am a mere henchman. Look at how much damage you did to me. I'm a giant dinosaur, bro. I am a giant dinosaur, and I, I barely sneezed at you. I'm worried those guys can't get up. I gotta be real, I'm a little worried those guys can't get up. Nate has some issues. I got so many issues. This game... It's four o'clock! It's four o'clock! I cannot even finish this match! What is this game?! <laughs> what is this game?! Why am I not done? He's about to kill me! He's about to kill my giant dragon! These guys can't. They can't. They can't. They literally cannot. My, my dragon might die. My giant dragon might die because they can't get up the wall. Take the switch home, finish it later, and tell us the highlights. Uh, there are none. What highlights? What highlights? It's staring at the screen. Staring at the screen, waiting for someone to do something. Or for my giant dragon to somehow help. Do they have to enter down here? Is that the only place they can enter? All right, it looks like if I can survive, he'll be down next round. I want to finish this so bad. The elevation thing, probably not their best idea. Probably not the game designer's best idea they've ever had. Like, I want you to think about the game that always comes up in our conversations um, concerning, uh, you know, whatever, RPGs or any of those kind of things. The, the conver- oh, are you kidding me? Are you joking, dude? I don't have enough SP to do the thing. 
The conversation that always comes up for us is Super Mario RPG, right? And Super Mario RPG is an S-class game as far as it comes to doing the things. Winning the battle. Oh my goodness. All right, we've got to end it. Folks, welcome to Checkpoint Church. We're happy that you've been here. We're happy that you've joined us for this absolute nightmare of a battle. Um, I can't believe that I wasn't able to finish it on stream. I think we've been playing this one battle for an hour, maybe an hour and 15 at this point. And uh, I'm losing my mind, losing my marbles. We are Checkpoint Church, Church for Nerds, Geeks, and Gamers. We play games like this. Sometimes they're good. Sometimes they're real bad like this one is currently being. Uh, I am a nerd pastor, Nate. I am really the pastor of this nerdy community. And um, we are really a Church for Nerds, Geeks, nerds, geeks and Gamers planted here on Twitch, Discord, and YouTube. If you'd like to learn more about some of the things that we do, exclamation point Discord in the chat. That's where all the best bits happen. All the best stuff comes together there. We'd love to have you there and welcome you into our ranks in that field. Uh, we also post a nerdy sermon every single Sunday over on our YouTube. Uh, exclamation point YouTube in the chat if you'd like to learn more about that. We did a She-Hulk most recently. It was excellent. Very fun. And folks, we believe three things to be true about every single one of you out there. We believe that number one, God loves you. Number two, we love you. Number three, we believe that you, yes, you matter, no matter who you are or where you've been or what you're about. Um, but we believe that God loves you and wants to know you. Okay, we're going to go re redeemed J. Redeemed J09. I think they might not be on anymore. I don't think they're on anymore. Um, so I got Jate and Eagle Garrett. We're going to go raid Jate. We're going to go raid Jate. It looks like he's going through games and figuring out all the games that he's played. So we're going to go raid, raid him. And uh, folks, thank you again for being here. Appreciate you. Let's go spam some You Matters in the chat. Um, we will probably not be playing this game again next Monday because I just can't do it anymore. I will play more of this game in my own time because I love Digimans, but I just can't do it on stream. All right, folks, until the next time that I see you, be well. Bye-bye.